What's my guy's name? Gayu. Gayu. That's actually a cool. Gayu. Okay. Uh, before we start talking to your mic. <coughs> hello, 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 hello. Esther. Hello, hello, hello. You, you a loud motherfucker, oh, huh, okay. Esther? Yeah, I'll lower you down. I'll lower <laughs> you. Already blo- you already blowing it out. Hey, turn it up. Wait. Oh. What? Whoa. <laughs> my fault. My fault. My L. My L. Um, <laughs> Esther, Esther, do uh, talk again? Hello, hello. Okay. Um. Go ahead. Yo. Go ahead. Well, hello, <laughs> hello, hello. <laughs> okay. Esther, you actually look like her. It's super cool. Mom, you want to have a little bit of like, like, like him? to me? Mm-hmm. And I, don't <laughs> I don't even know how your characters uh, look like. Do I look like him? Yeah. No. <laughs> not, not even in the slightest bit, my friend. Uh, hey, this He's, is the same mic, huh, that we have? Yes, that Where is the same mic. you have to like mic. talk like right here? You don't have to. I mean, I'm not stressing about it because they all like... Devin, when he has conversations with people, he's literally like this the entire time. So you're fine. Still? Still, yeah. man. It's, I'm not, it's crazy. I'm still, I've got the hang of it. Yeah. Would you say Would still you say that uh, UTI is like really professional at this point? Is this on? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You think so? Yeah. Yeah, we are too. We're very we professional. Are too. You spill... At least every podcast we've done for the yeah, past yeah. three podcasts, bro. You've spilled. Don't worry, it'll be on the side. Esther. No. Damn. No, bro. That's yeah. a lot of oh water, Devin. God. What are you? Oh, God, Devin. That's halfway. I'm yeah. almost there. Uh, That's how he has good skin. Yeah. He drinks lots of water. Period. He spills half of it, though. He, <laughs> he literally hydrated. spills half of his water. Hey, hey, whoa, 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 oh, whoa. It'll, it'll, be it'll be on the floor. It'll be on the floor. Anyways, though. Mike taller than me? The mic? It seems like it is. It might be. Is it dropped down? No, that's it. That's as far down as it goes. Oh, you, can, you can hold it. You can hold it. Marty, are you ready? <sighs> yes, I'm ready. Well, go ahead, Miss Girl. Sign us in. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to another video and audio. Today, we're back with another podcast. <laughs> yeah. And I'm going to be your host, Maru. And today, our theme is Demon Slayer. Hell yeah. I picked it. Now I'm not gonna Wait. lie, you killed it with these costumes though. Look at these fire ass costumes. These costumes are actually super sick. So who are you? I told you like eight times, Sage. You did. They were expensive. Though. I did tell you. You did. Yeah, we have... what does it start with? Hold on, what does it start with? <laughs> it's gonna be really bad. Just 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 guess it and no, please don't I'm make it racist. Don't that. make it racist and just <laughs> guess it. Try it. One. Juan <laughs> <What> is crazy. <laughs> you might have it though. Yeah, you're you're close. Have he it. looked at it you're and close. said one. Like you're, you're, uh, there's no way I'd be able to guess the name. No Zenitsu. What? Zenitsu. Zenitsu. It's actually a sick name. Uh, oh. Nezuko. Why did I... Nope, that's that Tanjiro. one. Tanjiro. Nope, that's me. What the fuck, man? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Did you ever tell her name? Yo, no, you sent me. Honestly, sent me I don't know the name. It's the butterfly Hashira, but I don't. She know doesn't even have a name. Is. Does she not she have a name? Is this butterfly Hashira? No, or it might be kind of. Well, on the know. costume thing you sent me, it was okay. Hold on. Oh, that's the name right there. N Q Q I. Is Q-Q-I. there a way to to compare to compare to compare what we look like in order to the people? Yeah. Oh, Shinobu Kocho. Oh. Sebastian, can you go ahead and put a picture yeah, next of everybody. everybody's uh, character? Ready? Uh, Sebastian, I'm up first. Zenny too? <laughs> that was a good photo. I was gonna, me? I was almost going to embarrass myself. You're going to what? That's no, good. nothing, nothing. Okay, I was well, going to say your name for yeah, his. Oh, you're about to say Tanjo? Yeah. <laughs> you're, who are you? Oh, wait. Go, I told go, you. Go. I told you. Who are you? God. I know, I know. Come on. Starts with a G. You Don't almost got it. Guy. Like, how you? How you? The the bald Gaiu. dude, tell me. Yeah, Gaiu. Gaiu. I'm Gaiu. Gaiu. I'm Gaiu. Gaiu. I'm Nezuko. And I'm Tanjiro. And Where's I'm missing. brothers and sisters. I'm missing. I'm missing my um, Inosuke. You better be nice to me. This whole you're supposed to be nice to me. So yeah. Let's see if I don't know if that's happening. But... He matches. I'll try my best though. Um, but yeah, guys, Sean is currently sick right now. Otherwise, he'd be here with us. But when Sean gets sick, the whole world has to stop and uh, yeah. take care of him. So yeah, yeah. it's pretty bad. I'm going back tonight. Did you guys see him pull up last night with the big ass fucking jug of water? That looked like he a gallon. Like it, was the, a gallon it was a gallon of water. It was it was the big, that was bigger on. than a gallon, bro. What is that? Yeah, that like, shit was big. A jug. It was like the no, it's not uh, like, bigger than a jug. I, I put those on my big old thing to filter the water. Exactly, bro. He got that big ass one. He drinks hella water when he's sick. Drowns himself. It's scary. Yeah, it's super scary. You guys, Wait, he gets really bad. He gets super mm. sick. Oh, I like, thought you meant like he was a baby. So like, oh, the whole world has to stop. No, that's what I mean. No, no, that's what I mean though. Like, I don't honestly, if I'm being sorted ass. I feel like that boy milking it, so that so that so that we can do stuff for him. But I don't, I'm not too sure. But like literally, when he's sick, it's like I can't do nothing. Don't talk to me. He's yeah. just he's in his room. Yeah. Like he's not even playing like uh, video games. Like he's literally just curled up in, making his, bed, a like, in his bed. Oh, making a statement. Dang. He's making a statement. He wouldn't let me touch him. Why do you want to touch him? I like shake his hand, not thing weird. <laughs> 
Oh, he's sick. Never mind. <laughs> All right, oh, man. Mind. Anyways, w- today we have a special guest. Cynthia. If you guys probably already know her <laughs> from UTI. Cynthia Choi. <laughs> Hey, they, I'm they sometimes call me Bintia, but you know, oh, <laughs> whatever you want. You said you said hello. People um have like said you're from Supper Talks. Or yeah, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. No they call way. me Maru. They call you Maru. There's they call me Maru. No That's gotta way. be racist. That's I was like, we don't look anything alike. <laughs> That's what I'm but saying. I'm like, I'll take it. She's she has clout. <laughs> I'll take it. I'm not gonna lie. Y'all look a little similar. Like y'all, like in, in like you would look like you could be her older sister. Let's be real. Yeah, older I can, sister. I can, I can see, see older that. Sister. Older can sister, see right? That. Oh, <laughs> these wrinkles got you or what? What's no, <laughs> no. I just, I, Esther, I you see literally it. look so young. <laughs> you look really good for your age. Yes, 40, 45? really, really. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> almost 53. <laughs> <laughs> How old are you guys? Thirty six. She's not 36. You're not, you're not 36. 36. Last time you told me. Oh, I'm 42. <laughs> Fine. You, got, you, you go, almost got you it. Go. There you go. Get it closer here. You got to remember. I know that Alzheimer's kicks in around like, what, 45, 40, oh, 43? It's, 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 it's true. It's true. It's true. <laughs> no, wait. No, you're two, uh, 30, 30, 31. Hey, fuck off, no man. <laughs> All right, 28. You're 28. No, no. Nobody knows my age. 27. It's uh, confidential. Confidential? Yes. Can you go like this? I, I know it. But, but I, I am on famous birthdays. I was about to Google it. Let's go. Did you go like this under the table or something? Oh, yeah. Show the number under the table. How do you show that number? 50? <laughs> what, what number does she throw up? What number does she... Four? She threw up two fours? Oh, I love oh my how... God, 24, I love guys. How, God. 24, okay. uh, Every okay. time we hang out with UTI, that's all we joke about literally <laughs> their age old. just so them being old is, yeah you guys don't ever joke More about knowledge. how much money More we knowledge. have oh, oh you know what <laughs> let's let's start doing that let's start doing that because i do know that you guys got the retirement fund that you can lean back on right yeah. oh my yeah, goodness yeah i'm there i'm on it we're 45 <laughs> <laughs> do you ever get mistaken for esther no never esther but um oh one time at a club but this girl was stupid drunk oh she, she, she thought she she met me already and i was like no you haven't and then, like, later she comes down and she's like, I'm so sorry. I thought you were her. And I was like, Oh, okay. Uh, she yeah. apologized. Do you guys ever take offense to that? No. Um, no. Only when, I like, I don't look at like them at all. I'm like, You gotta be racist. Not like you two together, but just like when someone says somebody that you're not. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no. But I get Nicki Minaj. All right. Okay. No, that, I, don't, I right. swear. They gotta be joking. I swear on my life. I swear on my life. Some people, like, say you're the Asian Nicki Minaj, and someone says I'm Cardi B. I can see Cardi B. No, be a dead ass honest. So weird, I don't usually, see it. I don't see, see it. I don't, I yeah. Usually, usually when I walk around, I get YG really? a lot. Or like Usher. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, guys, I know people are going to hate. There's so, no way you're being no, trust serious. Me, I don't think so. Yeah. Okay, I'm telling you, can't you see other Cardi people B. do. I could be some people, some people. Fam, I see what? a little bit. I do. Cardi Just B? without the, the melatonin. Look closely. I'm looking extremely close. She does not look anything like Cardi B. I know what Cardi B looks like. Huh? Melanin. Doesn't really sound like you know what she looks like. Huh? They look alike. As much as you look like YG, <laughs> that's not so very alike. Is what you're saying. <laughs> right? no, okay. But... She just has. <sighs> nah, man. How about you're this? Tweaking. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There you go. Then I'm getting it. Then I'm getting it. The craziest one I saw. Somebody said they feel like I look like Jackie. Wow. Jack- wow. Jackie? Jackie? Like our Jackie? Our Jackie. Wow. I no, saw you guys it in one of look anything alike. That's what I'm saying. It was under one of her videos and she was like redoing my makeup and she was like, OMG, like it looks so good. Honestly, I think you guys kind of look alike. And I was like, wow. That's- oh. Y'all need your eyes checked. Interesting. <laughs> like, interesting. That's pretty mm-hmm. crazy. I've never been confused with any of them before. I know y- y'all had gotten confused. Uh, in the beginning, it was a lot. Yeah. yeah. I think me and Sean look a lot different. No, I've never gotten confused. I've never been like. Someone thought that I was one of the other guys in the group. Oh, uh, what about you guys? Yeah. Just me. Just you? Okay. Yeah. Or oh, Julian. Julian. Oh, Sweet yeah. Well, yeah. Devin. They tell me that a lot. Whoa. I see Whoa. Julian. Yeah. You're like a more Hispanic version of him. He looks more white. Even, oh, he it? does. He does. He, hey, shout out to the boy Julian. He's going crazy right now. Devin, you know who he you are? Julian. You, who, do you know who you look like? I'm, I'm not Devin. <laughs> that is Devin. <laughs> He's. Did you not just say Devin? Do you know what you look like? What are you talking about, Devin? Oh my god, I'm fucking dead. Okay, Sage <laughs> Devin. Yeah, yeah there are you guys? Are you guys joking around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm right. kidding, y'all. Okay, I'm kidding. Did you, you like, actually fall? Hey, for you that? Guys, no, 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 I feel like you actually confused him. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm dead. <laughs> oh my god, I'm dead. The mad problem. What were you saying? What were you saying? Huh? What were you saying? You look so serious. Do you guys get any like celebrities? 
I told you. <laughs> <laughs> not being dead ass. I've not, not not celebrities. No, I don't think I've been told that I look like a celebrity. Mm. Mm, I feel like oh no no. Nacho Libre. Oh, oh, I'll take that yeah. one. I would, I would take that every day. And, 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 and with this, with this too, like a cape. Yeah. But more like Chancho. Like this, Chancho. Chancho from Nacho Libre, though. <laughs> That's wild. Yeah, yeah, yeah. More I, like get, that. I get Esqueleto from uh, Esqueleto. Yeah. yeah, yeah, he's fucking. Yeah. Oh, I love Esqueleto. I used, to, I get that when my hair gets really long. You yeah, watch skinny you, yeah. you watch yeah. Nacho yeah. Libre? Yeah. Yeah. You have? Yes, of course. Oh, that's crazy. I think she's watching. Just because I'm Asian? Well, I don't know. I thought it was. I don't watch anime. I'm wearing this apron. You don't watch any anime before? <laughs> apron. apron. <laughs> <laughs> so I did as look like a, 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 what I wore when I used to work at a sushi restaurant. <laughs> you know? <laughs> you Guys, so is she... What does that mean? <laughs> I can't tell you. What does that mean? I think it means welcome. How do you what say do you mean it? you think? I don't know. Oh. She's, she's like, Korean. Korean. I'm Korean, bro. I forgot too. She was Japanese. <laughs> oh sorry. my gosh. My fault. My fault. My fault. My also, fault. guys, doesn't Esther look exactly like her? Like the search her up. Right? No, yeah. exactly like her. Literally, hair, eyes, everything. What was I gonna say? Was that a joke? <laughs> you, know? you did. <laughs> you did is. work at the. Uh, huh? Mm-hmm. Did you like it? When I was younger, uh, yeah, because they gave us free food. Oh shit. Oh. Was the tip fat? Huh? Tip. Was it oh. fat? Oh, tip. No. Man, they <laughs> didn't pay. They didn't pay a shit. Nothing? But I but I was like I work for for food. Yeah. Mm. That's, That's, like, That's, That's sometimes the best. I was like sixteen. Yeah. Yeah. I used to love getting the food at Old Spaghetti Factory when I got off my shift. I was still. Oh, you used to work there. I never and knew. They never called me back. Is that Allegedly, I used to steal everything. They never called me back. Allegedly. That's a good thing, bro. Everyone that worked at that fucking spot was high, like, all the time. Or you could yeah. smell, them. You could smell time, them sparking up. There was one time I got way too high and I had to leave work because I was way too high. Oh, no, I yeah. bet, dude. Literally, yeah. I could smell you guys sparking up a wood, like, below oh, me. Because you, you know how the kitchen was below the upper deck? Yeah. I, we would smell it, bro. And I was like, I, when I was little, too, I was like, it smells like skunk in here, mom. And she's like, yeah, I don't know. Maybe there's something outside. And I was like, mm -mm -mm. Can we <laughs> confirm? You can you confirm. Can. You, you can oh. confirm. Oh. Allegedly, they probably would. Mm, allegedly. allegedly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, allegedly, at my old job, it was actually maybe I shouldn't say where, but I used to work at a bun cake, bleh, bun cake place, right? And used to steal cakes all the time. The Is it nothing ones. but bun cakes? I'm just, I'm just throwing it out there. Allegedly, it might be. Oh, okay. Uh, but come does that place was fire. Like that. Also, I, I gained so much weight working there. Really? So much. Yes, because first of all, you could just. I can't talk today. You good, you good, you good. Do your exercises, do your exercises. <sighs> okay, uh, you could take the free samples, but also we would steal the cakes. <laughs> Even though we had unlimited samples. Are bun cakes the ones that are circular and they had a little hole in the middle? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah they're cake fire, How did they get so the hole good. in there? Huh? The pan is, oh. <laughs> I don't what? know, man. I don't even know if you want that He's creation. Right. He's give it, give it, give it, give it, give it. Because he really doesn't know. I don't either, to be fair. The pan shaped like that. Coochie. No, the pan shaped like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's like a this. hole right down the middle. No, yeah. there's no hole. It's a little, it's, a, it's no. an actual, oh. like, it's a pole. Yeah. yeah. It's like a, well, duh. If what? it's a hole, how is it gonna, it's gonna just yeah, be over it? Like, it needs something for the battery. Now I'm lost. There's the plate, right? Nick. Yeah, yeah. Use your critical thinking skills. Like this. Something coming up like, no. Hands Nick, like you're this. so lucky you're, you have curly Wait, hair. Look at why. Look, 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 look. look. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? Okay, <laughs> that's how it's Bun shaped. Cake, um... In the middle. There's like a hole, and then in the middle, there's a pole. But that's what I'm talking about. It goes like that. It but... doesn't go like that. What do you Wait, mean it goes like that? Show what I'm talking about. It, it doesn't make goes sense. like that. That doesn't make sense. The if there's a pole in the middle, wouldn't there be a hole in the cake? There's a hole in the cake. Just like, like, like that. But I thought <laughs> it was. Yeah. 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 I thought that it was just a cake with like a little dip in the middle. Like, like, yeah, like that. Yes, yes. That's what I'm saying. Oh, those what? cakes. Why is he saying that? What's going on? What, 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 what goes like that? starts here, and then it comes out like a cake. I don't know, but Cynthia is wants to get on with. The okay, episode. sorry. Oh, anyways, I don't want to explain anymore. Marta, go ahead. Take it away. Taking it away, everybody. Um. Sorry, I, I had the first question in my head, but I forgot it. It's okay. <laughs> okay. We're gonna about <laughs> okay. We're gonna start with a fun little question before we get into the deeper ones. So somebody asked, what's your Mount Rushmore of cereals? Ooh. Like your top your top five. Oh. Top five. Are there five heads on the Mount Rushmore or four? Good question. Let me search four. it up. Is there four? There's four. Jackson. But not Bush, Lincoln. Jackson, Washington. Washington. Link is not on there. He's not on there. No, no, no. Sure. Yeah, he is. Yes, yeah, he there's is. four. Lincoln is Walk not up. on there. Who's on there? 
Lincoln is definitely on, is, no, 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 Lincoln no. is not on there. I don't know. Wait, hold on. Let's actually figure this out. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. He's Before you look really it up, on Teddy, there. Teddy's on there. Teddy Roosevelt's on there. That's a good one. The goat. Who's the fourth one? Dude, it's gotta be Abe. It's, 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 it's Big Abe. Abe. Yeah. Link's, yes, he is. Wait, why would he not be on there? <laughs> Old man Link ain't on there. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Look, that's Lincoln right there. Oh my God, Abraham Lincoln's on Abe there. Link. Oh wow, my fault. Anyways, um, that's then do your top four, top four. <clears throat> top four. Ready? All right, I got it. Oh, Cocoa go. Pebbles. Valid, that's mine. Mm-hmm. Apple Jacks. No. No. Hot Frosted take. Flakes. Hot take again. Uh, Frosted Flakes, eh. Uh, Mid. Uh, special K. Oh, Chocolate. This is the worst nah. list I've ever yeah. heard in my Nightmare life. Nightmare cereal rotation. Sage, you can go. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. wait. You can that's leave. it, that's it, that's four, brother. No, no. She said five. No, four. no it's four. It's oh, Mount, Mount Rushmore. Rushmore. Mount Rushmore. Wait, really? Oh, I have my Apple Jacks. Can I say mine? Wait, what is he? Oh, Quicker grandpa? oats. The bunny. The bunny. Oh. <laughs> what's, the, what's the bunny one? What's the bunny one? Special K is crazy. Tricks. Oh, tricks are tricks. 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 Okay. Oh. tricks, are tricks is valid. Tricks is valid. Cinnamon toast. Valid. Okay, okay, that's my third. Captain Crunch. Oh, Captain Crunch. I like Cocoa Puffs. And I agree with you. I like. um. What's that guy again? Oh, Frosted Flakes. But 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 let me let me just think real quick if I had another one. They're great. Wait, y'all, y'all don't fuck with Fruity Pebbles? No, I was about, actually, no, 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 no. Yeah, I, I, would say, I would say Frosted Flakes. <laughs> it'd, be, okay, it'd be too much. It's too much going around. Four. Top four. Four, four, four. Captain Crunch, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Fruity Pebbles. Wait, what about, uh, what was that cookies uh, one? Right, no. Oh, dude. The Oreo? Chips of what? No, no, no. no, no. <laughs> Chips Ahoy is crazy. Sorry, I know what you're talking about. Wolf. There's a yes, wolf on yes, it. Yes, yeah, yeah, what's yeah. it called? It, cookie, dude. No, it's like dumb. Cookie, cookie crisps. Cookie, cookie crisps. Crisp. Cookie, cookie crisps. Crisp. That, that. I'll do that one. That's you know, a good one. But I ate that for a long time. Oh, yeah, we got played yeah, yeah. out of it. Same, bro. I had that shit for like breakfast and dinner. I'm going to do. I'm going to do. My mom left for a month. I'm going to do Frosted Flakes. Frosted Flakes. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Captain Crunch. The peanut butter Captain Crunch. Oh, okay. L-Takes. See, he wouldn't even know. He can't even taste it. L-Takes. No one else. No one else. He's just being a hater. No, just a heater. Um, Reese's Puffs and ooh, last one, Tricks. Oh. I don't know why I couldn't get into Reese's Puffs. I couldn't, I couldn't get into Reese's either. Puffs, right? Yeah, you it's just too much couldn't. peanut butter. <laughs> yeah, it's too much. Too much. It's I'll good. Like it. I, I like it. it. I don't right? like it. Um, Cocoa Puffs, Fruity Pebbles, Cookie Crisps, Cook Cookie Crisps, and um, raisin what did we say? Bread. No, not raisin bread. <laughs> What's wrong with raisin bread? <laughs> <laughs> not raisin bread. What was the Esther or no. What'd you say? You said something where I was like, oh shit. Cinnamon Toast Crunch? Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm doing those for. I'm doing those for. Right. Easily, easily. I love that shit. I also would, I put Fiber One. I'm not gonna lie, in my top five though. I love Fiber One. Fiber One? Yeah. Ew. You know, you guys never had it? Side Eye. Nah, dude, that shit was gas. Y'all never had it? Fiber One? They no, had I've, had it. I've had it. Yeah, yeah. It has like granola in it and like uh, brown sugar. It's super gas. Not gonna lie, never tried it, but it just sounds ass. Oh, no. no it's I really tried good. Special K, never had that one. You should try <laughs> Fiber One. It helps special with your K bowel K movements. Um, I, like I will the say the strawberry one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, special, special K, K is strawberry good. is so good. He said chocolate. So fucking good. Chocolate. He's oh, weird. never mind. I like the. I just like the chocolate. And it's dark chocolate. Oh. I like dark chocolate. You like chocolate? I like dark chocolate. Mm. I don't like milk chocolate. Do you like chocolate? What? That's a hot take. I like milk chocolate way better than hot chocolate. Dark chocolate. Hot chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> I like caramel. Let's move on. Caramel. Okay. Don't I do like caramel this. too. Caramel. So far. Caramel. Is caramel a type of um? Caramel apple. Chocolate? No. 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 It's just brown sugar mm. and like caramel. It's apple. just sugar. What? Caramel apple. <laughs> what about it? It's good. Do you like it when it has toppings on it? No. Just regular. You know, regular, this is why right? I like yeah, UTI because it's way more organized. Fuck no, I like this way better, man. <laughs> um, <laughs> I like the off topic. Fuck the on topic. It's fucking you two every time. <laughs> he said caramel apple. I had a guy to yeah, tell engaged. him I like I'm it. I'm sorry, yeah. Esther. No, I hope you're I having like fun. So Are you guys best friends? We're brothers. Yes. Yeah, we're more than that. Oh. Uh, the lovers. More than that. They're the lovers. Nighttime. Lovers. Yeah. That's cute. Brothers by blood, lovers by choice. Yeah, I'm pro gay rights. Amen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So. Do whatever you want. Ow. Ow. <laughs> yeah. I like that. Go ahead, Monica. Okay, first, the uh, second question of the night. So I seen this. Um, people talk about this in like Jimmy's podcast. I think they were talking about the difference between pretty, fine, and beautiful when guys like categorize girls. <laughs> do you guys have that? And like, give me examples if you do, of like. Famous woman. Or I feel anybody. like pretty and beautiful would fall would be the same thing. <laughs> really? My tweaking. I think it's a little different. Tell me. 
um beautiful is like damn like wow she's beautiful <laughs> like yeah. pretty yeah. is like yeah like, like she's cute yeah she, pretty is no. like not nah, pretty and cute like, is beautiful the same like it feels deeper yes. than pretty do you know yeah, what i mean yeah, yeah, like yeah. she's the most beautiful woman in i the feel world. that in my soul yeah, yeah, exactly. yeah i feel that in my soul Question. like she Ugh, you can't is, breathe. Is beautiful the same as gorgeous? Or is that different? Um, yeah, I would categorize. Or like stunning. <laughs> Who the fuck uses gorgeous? I just thought because when I hear beautiful, you kind of hear gorgeous at the same time. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Pretty much the same. Yeah, I think, for, oh, I think I know. Beautiful <laughs> right. is more from the inside. Yeah. Like overall, like personality mm -hmm. and face. And then gorgeous is like, she's like Victoria's Secret model, like her hair uh, blowing uh, in yeah. the wind. Yeah. Yeah. Gorgeous. That's you look so beautiful point. too. Thanks. God, hold on. You Thank look so you. gorgeous right now. Oh, which one's better? Beautiful. I think beautiful. 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 beautiful sounds gorgeous right. sounds too corny, bro. It does. Uh, gorgeous is corny. Yeah. Like you have a fedora, you're so gorgeous. <laughs> yeah, <basically. laughs> nah, I don't. I don't like that one. I don't like that one. I, I, but I consider it like cute, beautiful, and bad. That, oh. Those are my three <laughs> no, categories. No pretty. Mm. Like cute and pretty to me is the same thing. Like right. if I say that girl is extremely pretty, I would say that girl's extremely cute. Like yes. all like face card, like just. Really, really cute girl. And then beautiful is like what Esther said, like top notch and then bad. I'm thinking like I am scared of her and I'm sexually attracted <laughs> to that. Mm. Instagram baddie type. Yes. That yes. makes sense. Yes, yes, yes. So would you agree with like beautiful? It also has personality in it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. For okay. sure, for sure. Same with bad. The same with being bad though, like baddie energy. It scares me. Mm, like I am intimidated. Like attitude yeah, a little yeah, bit. Yeah, like I am intimidated. Like I do not want to go over there. But I want to. What know. would the guy's version be? Oh, that's oh, what I was gonna get into. Wow, Next. Well, is there more than just handsome? Yes. <laughs> well, I wrote mine down. Esther, do you have Grandma's like most handsome three categories? <laughs> um, handsome I mean, I, I've heard girls saying like, oh, that man's fine. Mm -hmm. um, oh, there's also fine. like hot, sexy. Mm -hmm. Question. Um, I've been hearing some rumors about you girls, ugly, hot, medium. What, what do you guys call medium it? Medium ugly? Medium yeah. ugly. Facts. Is that one of them? Wow. <laughs> wow. Hold up. Would you say okay, so what's your so you're saying handsome, fine. Yeah. Sexy. I don't say those, but I've what heard do you say? other girls. What do you oh when if you weren't in a relationship right now? Uh what would you call a really good looking? What do you man? call Jeremy? <laughs> Jeremy, man, I just be Call him Jeremy. She's like, let's come to Papa. <laughs> What I, I I just call him Jeremy. What if he has like a really you know, good, what, what, what if he has a fit on where you're like, boy. damn, my man is looking good right now. What are you telling him? You look. Oh, you look cute. Okay, oh, I was like, yeah, that's, that's good. good. That's good. That's I'll give it. I'll give it. I'll give it. I'll give it. Okay. I don't want to What's up with you doing? I like that, my man? men cute. Okay. That's valid. Cute. Like that's like, valid. Like sweet, funny, cute. You know, yeah. I don't really like that burly man type. Mm. I don't like, want to be the burly one. You want to be the burly one? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. What do you do to Jeremy? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if he lets me. Yeah. Oh. God damn. Well, for me, oh, I feel God. like when I see a man, I either categorize him as fine, pretty, or handsome. Pre oh, y'all oh, use pretty the word too? Pre yeah, you like, you know, pretty? Wow. pretty boys. Oh, pretty boys. Okay, yeah, yeah. Would you, yeah. What would you call a pretty boy? What would you call a pretty boy? Freaking so pretty? Like, wimpy. Oh. <laughs> a little bit. Mm. I mean, like, not, I mean, I, I don't, I guess it's because it's not my type. Got you. So I'm yeah. just like, if they're like, if they're, if they're prettier than me, then I'm just like, that's a woman. Do you think? But in a good way. Like, you you're guys, so pretty. Are you guys like unattracted to really pretty men? Yeah. Okay, but mm, can you, are you born naturally pretty or is it the way you take care of yourself? You know what I mean? Because I feel like a lot of pretty boys or pretty men are like take care of them like nah. themselves really well no it's just a it? look you have yeah so you like genetic. you just look pretty okay, exactly okay. softer Lusty. features <laughs> than like what you would call more chiseled men so like pretty boys have like a smaller face maybe like more paler skin if anything like oh. in korea it is and then like uh just their jawline it could be sharp but it's still like very like baby like got it mm. i don't know got it, got it, got it, got or it. i guess i in korea but in it, korea. i think if different races is a little different mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. For me, whenever I like kind of um, look at somebody pretty, it would be like Justin Bieber would be a pretty boy for me. Yeah. Um, I can see that makes sense. Who, who's another good example? Just like Timothy, Timothy. Chalamet. Oh, yeah. He would be pretty. Yeah. Who um, else? Zendaya's man. Devin Paul. Tom no. Holland. Tom Holland <laughs> no, isn't pretty, Tom though. Holland, he's I would say he's more boy. handsome. Yeah, than like, that's, 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 that's like a handsome dude. Yeah, yeah he's, he's got like a mature look. Like a sharp, sharp yeah. fellow. Oh, he's, he's a sharp He's fella. a cute boy. He's cute. He's on the cute. Yeah, he'd be cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you're a pretty yeah. boy. I guess there's cute too. 
Because pretty and cute for men aren't the same thing. It would be it's too different. Word. Yes. It's yeah. Different. It's different. It's definitely it's different. different. So I'm for blushing. men, pretty and cute wouldn't be the same thing. Because like Zendaya's boyfriend is cute. Spider Man. Spider Man is cute. He's cute, but he's not pretty. You know what I yeah, mean? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So someone fine would be like Michael the B. Jordan. Ball. <laughs> I don't find Mike hot take. Please don't come at me, girls. I you think Russell Westbrook is fine? Yeah, you don't want to come at me. You don't want to come at me. Wait, wait, you don't think who? Michael B. Jordan is. Oh, that. I agree. No, no, hold on, hold Thank up. You. Show her a picture of who she thinks is fine. Okay, no, I'm a changed woman. Um, JK, no, I still Sebastian, think he's fine. Sebastian, go ahead and pull up a picture of Russell Westbrook right now over the glasses. I may be biased. I may be biased. You know who Russell Westbrook is? It's definitely not Esther type. Oh, okay. I think I know who it is. Hold on, just show me though. Yeah, you'll know him. But I may be biased. That's it. Cause I only have eyes for Jeremy. If you're watching, Jeremy ain't watching you. this shit. <laughs> oh whoa! Yeah, Jeremy. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you, there you, you, th you like him? I don't know. I've always had a crush on him ever since I was, since I was like maybe because he's really good at his thing. <laughs> I I think it's just his mannerisms. Like I've watched interviews and I don't know. He just seemed like real confident and I don't know. It was something fine about that. See, fine also comes with the way you act. It's that, that, is that confidence, true. The energy, the, the energy. energy. That is it, true. Just, that it just is, throws me off like, when I hear Russ West in, in the conversation. Yeah, yeah. yeah but like, I do agree with that because, like I said, like same thing with baddies. Energy. It comes off with like how they walk, like how right. they like how they move and stuff like that too, for sure. Otherwise, yeah. she's just gonna like. Like really pretty girl or beautiful girl, exactly. so I can agree with that. I can agree with that. Exactly. How would you say Nick moves? Mad handsome. Wait, look that way real quick and then look back at me. Hold on, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, ready, ready. All right, go ahead. Okay. Wow, well, that was hot. Yeah. That was pretty hot. Well, I'm that not gonna base it on personality because this is more based on looks. But yeah, yeah. I would say like Nick out of the category would be handsome. What's up, shorty? Yeah, I knew, I knew it. Like another example would be like Massimo, Massimo or. The Machismo. Act, Machismo. Machismo. Oh, no. The actor. Wait, wait, wait. There's an... Oh, fuck. Hold on. Let me search it up, y'all. Massimo. What's Chino? Is am, it, I, am I tripping? Target... Who are you thinking of? <laughs> Yo. Wait. wait. Who are you thinking Don't... of? Can I categorize you guys? Yeah, go ahead. Oh, okay. yeah. This guy. You guys have seen him. I've never seen this man in my entire life. But like, thank you. This is such a compliment. So he would be handsome. That is the most handsomest man I've ever it. seen in my life. Oh, he's from that Can one. Uh, uh, that, that, he's on just yeah. 65 days. Yeah, I, mean, I don't Netflix. know what. I, don't know I what never that watched is. that movie, yeah. but he's mad Italian. I appreciate, I appreciate oh, you, bro. yeah. So he he's would never, be handsome. Never seen him before. He said Disney. Oh, wait, hold up. Uh, Esther's gonna categorize us, and you tell me if you agree with her. Okay. <laughs> okay. So well, I agree with Maru. Esther. Got you. Okay. I agree with Maru. Um, handsome, and then you guys are pretty boys. Pretty boy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How do you feel about that? I'm okay with. I that. wouldn't like it if it was in 2016, but now I'll take it. Yeah. Oh, you wouldn't like it if it was in 2016. Because Pretty Boy was a different meaning back then. Yeah, mm. that is very true. Really? Why? It's like a fuck boy. Yeah, it's like a F boy. Oh, what's what's wrong with that? No, like everyone wanted to be a fuck boy for like the first couple months. And, and then after real... that, everyone was just like, no, no one wanted to fuck with the fuck boy. Um, yeah. Uh, okay, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, what do you think? Honestly, right now though, Pretty Boy is such a high compliment. Mm -hmm. Um, Handsome, I would say handsome slash pretty and then pretty. The... Mm -hmm. yeah. boyfriend. <laughs> no. <laughs> that was a new boyfriend. No. Mm. I can agree with that. I can agree Esther, with that. you're beautiful. Out of the yeah, three we boy. talked about. <laughs> she said, she said, she said, she said, she didn't know what to say. <laughs> she didn't know what to say. I think, oh, I think Maru's more like the, like the baddie. What? When I saw her, I was like, she's a baddie. <laughs> That Literally, ass. yeah, like an IG model baddie. That's what I thought. Actually, that's when I first saw you, I thought you were like an IG model like baddie. And then I got to know you and it's beautiful now. What's up? When I saw you guys, <laughs> I, I thought you guys were all so bad. Yeah, right? I wanted all you guys so bad. That's all. I should put that out there. Anyways, yeah, now that's, that's, those are the categories I would use though. Yeah. Those are the ones I would use. Fine, cool. handsome, pretty. See, yeah. see, see, see. Wait, I'm trying to think for girls though. What do you mean? How, what do you mean? If I agree with your y'all's category, have you heard different? Honestly, yeah. For Be girls, beautiful. Yeah. No, bad. usually girls, it's all the same. It's always beautiful, pretty, and cute. No, no, oh, no, no, no. Beautiful, bad, and pretty. Oh yeah, but like pretty and cute get like interchangeable. Interchangeable. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wait, but cute can be like personality as well. No, yeah, she like, got a she got a bubbly personality. She's cute. But I feel like yeah, I feel like sometimes men if. You're introducing like a, a homegirl to a man. They're like, yeah, she's cute. 
isn't it sometimes oh. isn't it sometimes offensive like, oh, like you're trying to be you're trying to be nice but like you're you don't really think she's I pretty can't. like I, okay so like my friend's trying to set me up with this girl and then he's like oh what do you think of her and i'm kind of like oh she's cute yeah 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 i think it depends on how they say because if yeah. i'm shrugging yeah. like that yeah. oh she's cute like <laughs> Damn, I didn't think about that actually. No, that's yeah, a good you point. know exactly. That's what I noticed yeah. exactly because you guys don't want to be mean because yeah. that's someone's friend. So you say she's cute, but then like well, sometimes you be smirking a don't, little. Don't bit. like you guys do the same thing with guys. He's cute. Like yeah, he's cute. Oh wait, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it no? goes both ways, honey. It definitely it goes, goes both ways. ways. Actually, no. I say, I say, I hope he has a good personality. <laughs> oh. oh wow. Okay. Because, you on, because honestly, a, a good personality goes a long yeah, way. Yeah, I say the same thing too. Very. True. I either say, oh, he's okay, or I'm glad we don't have the same type. <laughs> dude, I'm telling you, that's the worst. Yeah, that's dude, worst. that's shit's that's offensive, worst, right? That's the worst thing ever. Yes, bro. I say the same thing. He's not my type, exactly. But no, no, no. no. But she's like, I'm glad we don't got the same type. Oh, okay, that's yeah. that's okay. just like a little extra word. But that's, that's only with difference. my bestie. Every man she sends me on TikTok, I'm like. Oh, if you send it, oh, if you're sending dudes, then that's different. But like, if she introduced you, oh, yeah, you, you know what I mean? That'd be crazy. Or like, you know oh, like. Oh, she's talking to somebody already. Yeah, and then you yeah. say like, "Oh, I'm glad he, we don't have the same yeah, type." That's, that's yeah, I would say I would, that. I would be that's, pressed. Honestly, would be that's pressed. so sad. But I, or you say like, "Oh, he's nice." Yeah, he's nice. Oh, he's a yeah. nice guy. He's he, nice looks guy. Nice. <laughs> he looks nice. Looks <laughs> nice. Wow, yeah. I would hate to get that. Is that bad? <laughs> he looks it nice. is a good, nice guy. Yeah, it is a little bad. Yeah, I feel like we do that every time. Like, like we'll 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 encounter like a boyfriend or something. Like, oh, he looks like a nice guy. Yeah, oh, he looks like he's cool. I say, I say, oh, he looks like he's cool. Yeah. Wait, what does that mean then? When you guys say that to a guy. I don't know, actually. I, that's good. I never thought, yeah, right? It's, it's like good. usually a good thing. Yeah. It's like a cool guy. Yeah, like, like the yeah. few times like, you brought like a dude around, I, yeah, I was, I was like, oh, he seems he seems chill. Like, he seems cool. Yeah. And you were wrong. And then, and then like two months fast forward and we're like, yeah. she, Maru's okay. just completely traumatized. <laughs> <Yeah>. Completely <laughs> traumatized. Wait, Maru, who do you trust? If when you bring a guy, who do you trust to give you like an actual honest opinion? Well, none of them. They Wait, all thought he was a okay. chill dude at first, so. Because I was about to say, from the times that like you've introduced me to a dude for the first time, I've never gotten like I maybe because I'm not looking that deep or like trying to look that deep, but I'm always like, oh, the dude's chill. Like, oh, they're well, always we cool. Really I will a... meet him when it's on good terms, though. Okay, that is true. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. not like you guys met him a lot. No, we, yeah. we barely even said what's up, and that was pretty much it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. So uh, and then, then we heard everything. Oh, this guy's not. So yeah. yeah, chill. And then we told you. Mm. They were like, you know <laughs> yeah. what? Maybe, yeah. maybe you should block him. <laughs> yeah, right. And I was like, well. Well, but did I end up doing it? Yes, I did. A couple, couple months later. Anyways, <laughs> Esther, do you, out of the UTI people, I'm curious, who do you trust the most? About oh, could I, I trust the most? Yeah. Um, to give you advice, just in general. Advice on what? Like it? Uh, it depends. About guys or about like life advice? Let's do dudes. Mm -hmm. Huh? Dudes? dudes? Oh, with dudes. I trust all of them. I really do. When you see a new dude, are you ever going to any of the guys on the UTI team asking like... Oh, like, I would, I would. You would? Yeah, yeah, I would. Do you t ask all the dudes or do you beeline it to one person specifically? Well, I mean, because I have a fat crush on Jeremy, if mm. I liked another guy, I wouldn't ask Jeremy, you know? Because mm -hmm. mm. I have to make sure that Jeremy knows that I'm still available mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and only waiting for him. Mm -hmm. So yeah, but yes, I would I would ask uh, Wutog, Vit, Eddie, because I, I really do trust her. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. They're straightforward, you know. They're very brutal to me. Yeah, I feel. Have I been brutal to you? No. Have I given you the the guy bestie talk where I'm like, yeah, that guy don't fuck with you? No, right? Um, not that. More like, oh, he's a, he's honestly a shitty ass person. You need to break up with him. But never. <laughs> pretty straightforward, if you ask me. Yeah, that, that sounds pretty that straightforward sounds to me. Pretty, yeah, okay, yeah. Honestly, I feel like all of you guys kind of just did tell me that. I, yeah, I think so. I, I would just, want I someone to tell me that. Yeah. 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 Honestly, very thankful. Yeah, but honestly, like I said, my, you, I've talked about it before. I don't like getting involved in the lives of, like, the relationships of my friends yeah. at all, unless they are really hurting. Then I'm like, and I'll <laughs> say something. But even then, I think it's very rare that I'll be like, "You need to break up with this yeah. person." You got know what right. I mean? I rather yeah. just be like, "Oh, like they're a terrible person." Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? I don't think you should say anything unless they ask you. Mm -hmm. You know, and they like, say, should like, I "What break do you up think?" Yeah, like, yeah, like should I or like, what do you think about this? Then, like, they're giving you an opening to yeah. like state your opinion yeah, yeah but other than that i wouldn't be like i don't like this guy this yeah. guy you're seeing i don't like him it's just yeah. like man you're gonna lose a friend what's up guys sorry to interrupt this podcast but if you guys wanted to catch more of us you should check out our patreon so if you guys want to get to know us a little better we're gonna be playing games we're gonna have interviews we're gonna be 
your ranking on there so if you guys want to go check that out the link will be in the description you'll see us getting way more deep in there we're gonna be spilling the tea and we also get a lot more intimate with each other so you guys won't want to miss out check these clips out from our last couple of videos on patreon to see why you guys should subscribe hope to see you guys there who's most likely to hook up with a friend's parent wow wow oh man i gotta give it oh and it's you oh. ah, you think so uh, I was at, scared. Me, at me this a, table give me give me something how often do you hear me talking about Older your guys' moms oh. versus how often oh. those moms oh. talk about your dad hold on Damn. wait wait wait, wait. Oh. i have a counter attack oh shit counter but <laughs> who actually did it Oh, who actually? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> not a friend's mom, but somebody's mom. But not a friend's mom. That's that, not the place. But friend. the thing, okay, yeah, okay. But like the thing is though, you think I actually would fuck a parent? Okay, hold on. Really? Hold on. Obviously, I see it as a joke. Have, so you've you've never really with, you never gotten you never gotten with right the father now. like a baby daddy you've never, never okay if anything you have so a yeah. father? Honestly, a yeah, father? Dad, no dude. a mother so i think you <laughs> should put yourself i can't pick up that's that's one of the rules you can't pick yourself okay fine well i still think it's owen okay you know i'm gonna have to confer sage because I'm gonna I'm give it I'm gonna give it I'm 50 50 right now because she has a point you've she, never been with a man over 30 years old it. yeah you have 25 over 25 no oh he has but this is the thing though. He's Multiple. Never, he's never one. And, but the, the question is, the question friends. is a friend. Friends. It is friends. The question is a I've friend. I've never heard of anybody talk about moms and dads except for you. Except yeah. for her. Except uh, for you. Yeah. I, that's the only reason why. But if it wasn't that, then I'll for no, sure no, no, go no, for him. sure. If it was hook up, it if it was hook up with a parent, it's him. I've seen but his family with a woman not. over six years. <laughs> And you're still picking me? That's it's, crazy. It's friends. It's friends. It's friends. It's friends. That's, that's the only Damn. reason why. That's the Guys, only reason why. Guys, I would never fuck <laughs> No, no, no. You wouldn't. You wouldn't. I'm not saying you would. I'm not saying you would. I'm sorry, Manu. Damn. Oh. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one, though. Who is most likely to give money to the homeless and change their mind and take it back? What? <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> no uh, he, wait. He looks straight at you when he dude, was reading. No, I, I always give money to the homeless. Oh, dude. Hold it's up. a good deed. I, I think it's always a good deed. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why I'm thinking. I would take it back. Oh, Look at me, dude. How, how much is most? Uh, Jesus, what's I have most, my rebuttal. What's the most amount of money you give to a homeless person? I'd give a homeless person twenty bucks. Sean? Have you given a homeless yeah, person? Yeah, bucks? yeah. How often do you give money? To Only when there's a girl sitting passenger. How much? Like twenty bucks. <laughs> like Not twenty bucks or lie. twenty bucks. Like that was the most. Wow. I, give, I like giving money. Power move. Okay. I have my rebuttal if you pick me. So. See, I feel like you're very generous when it comes to that. He, did you hear what he just said? <laughs> Tell him what he said. He, he said, said, I only give money to homeless man when there's a girl in the passenger seat. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, Thank wow. you, man. Nick is the okay, stingiest so now motherfucker. Okay, it's between two people. Okay. Well, I can, I can put Sean back in this. Okay. Why would I would have no need to take the, the money back? Why would I take the money back? <laughs> it's right now at this stage. I have no need to take the money back from and the homeless guy. I have guy. no need either. I don't think. Now, I, now I, let, me, let me go ahead and say this, though. I feel like. I'm thinking Cynthia. Oh, what, you call me broke? No, no, no. I'm just saying I feel like you'd be like, oh, yes. actually, I need that. Hey, actually, I need that. Yeah. <laughs> I could see you, like, giving it to him and then later on being like, like oh, oh, fuck, wait. I actually need that. I kind of needed Thank that you. for weed. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, let me hear your argument then. And also, your argument isn't, like, don't pick me. It ha your argument has to be for someone else like, at dude, the table. Dude, it would be Sean. I'm thinking Sean. Why? I would be, like too scared to like go up to them and ask for it back. Sean would have the balls to do it. Sean would have the balls. Sean would have the balls though. You think no, no, I would that's do so that? You would be you know, a dog you think actually. I would, you I think I'd be like, I I'd be like, Sean, can you go get it back for me? And you'd be like, hey, okay. <laughs> that's facts though. I, uh-uh. No. Oh, but, 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 bro. she's the one who wanted the money back though in that scenario still though. No, but, I'm it don't matter. Saying, the question is, I, give the money and take I, it back. No, no, I got saying, you. I got you. No, 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 no. I'm saying, even if I did want it back, I would never even do it because I'm scared to. So I, but you would want it back. No. Listen, babe, it's, it's your pick. I'm just saying I'm out of this. Oh, dude, I kind of want to pick Sean, though. <laughs> go ahead and pick I feel like You are so easily I'll persuaded, go Sean. <laughs> you go with Sean? Yeah. Sean, do you have anything to say? Uh, you get a drink, Sean. <laughs> oh. There's some bad words that would come out of my mouth if I open it right now. Tell us, tell us, tell us. What is your issue today? Okay, so I'm calling in for my friend because my friend is somewhere else right now. But... I need help. I need help convincing her to break up with her boyfriend. Oh. Because oh. Wait, hold so she's been coming over like 500 times, right? Because she's my best friend. And oh, sorry. You're good, she's you're good. Like, 
she's always talking about how like uh, there's always some part in our day when we're hanging out saying oh like her talking about her problems and I feel like it's just not good for her and so one of the things that really make me get like Ugh, you know is the um fact that her boyfriend like doesn't allow her to hang out with no guys doesn't allow her to post herself on what? a public story and she keep he keeps on thinking that she's gonna somehow cheat on him when that's she's the, he's the only thing that she's ever posted she has a whole story about him she only posts him on tiktok she only posts him on instagram like that's the only thing that you will find on her social media nothing her though like on her own stuff like like there's um the only post that she has is her and her boyfriend at like prom and then like the only posts that have her in it are like the like on her friends only because her boyfriend can see like her boyfriend stalks who she like who follows her and who she, she follows on instagram yeah, and it's like she keeps on telling me how every time she's hanging out with a guy she's like he's always saying oh like really does the boyfriend have pictures of her up though too <laughs> I, I don't think so no <gasps> he, wow. girl he sounds the, like the biggest red fucking flag the ever man, i'm gonna tell you that two things cheated. tell you three things actually that boy One, cheating or something either cheater and he's okay, projecting. I'm, I'm, and he's projecting. Cheater, cheater projecting and fucking insecure, dude. Insecure as fuck. That's crazy. Not letting nah, her dude. post herself. How old is she? Okay, so she's fifteen. We're both fifteen, and she's they, they've been together for like a year now, and she doesn't want. She's like so iffy on breaking up with him because for how long they've been together, because. How, how long have they been together? Y'all haven't hit puberty yet. <laughs> Other than that, guys, enjoy the rest of this podcast. Let's move on to the next question. Okay. Legalize eating ass. What? <laughs> I thought it was already legal. I've been... Oh. oh not teasing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing it. Okay. You might be going to jail after this podcast. Yeah. Allegedly. 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 Okay, how do you tell the difference between an argument stage and someone who's just a toxic person? Oh, y'all take that oh. one. Can you... What 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 is the difference between... Argument stage and a toxic person? Yeah. Or someone who's just, like, toxic in general. How to differentiate? Uh, big thing is you see change. Like, pretty much directly after things happen. Or not directly, but, like, mm -hmm. after each time, you see progress mm. or the effort towards progress because you don't always get it fast these are spitting yes. actually that's yes. a good ass point yeah yes. mm. okay so progress basically would yeah you, would you say something different um no i think no. that makes sense yeah um because someone who's just toxic in general wouldn't change yeah no. they just keep getting mad at it's a reoccurring things, right? problem yeah. gaslighting gaslighting keep doing it God, sean yeah. sounds like sean sounds like sean <laughs> I was like, a whole lot of Sean. How do you deal with it? <laughs> oh, my God, you guys. People are what? genuinely going to think we're dating. He said, oh, me up. shit. Oh, okay. oh, shit. Yeah, um, we're we yeah. rolling right now. Hey, down. it's not my fault. This oh. fool's reposting TikToks of, you did of, of, of ship edits with you and Sean. He set me up. That was a he little set bit me up. You nah, reposted? Bro. He, he set reposted me up. It. You bro. guys are trolls. Was, Wait, what are you talking about? It wasn't even on my account. I, I, no one's going to believe me. Wait, do you? So, so basically, there's a rumor that you and Sean are dating? It's not a rumor. Oh, oh you my god, allegedly. Yes. it's a rumor. It ain't no allegedly. Rumor. allegedly. Okay. It's not even a rumor. People just like ship us, right? Yeah. But then this guy reposted a video, <laughs> and so people like took it more serious. Hey, add one person to the ship. Yeah. <laughs> no, I, no, wait, why not? Why not? It, what's wrong with him? Oh, wait, a lot. Oh, okay. <laughs> you a know, lot. Maru, Maru, I don't want you seeing that person no more. Oh, no. Nah. And I'm saying this as a person. No. <laughs> I'll tell you that, Maru. You dodged a bullet. Good thing. Good thing you don't There's like dark chocolate. There's nothing wrong with Sean. It's just... I'm he's I'm not attracted to him. He's my friend. You know what I mean. Yeah. I'm sorry, y'all. Yeah. Who like yeah. does? Yeah. Wait, does Someone's Sean gonna... think differently though? Ooh. No, it's all. Anytime he does, it's for the cameras. Oh. oh no, Sean knows how. To, Sean's like Peter Malark from the Hunger Games. <laughs> Sean, knows, Sean knows how to play the cameras. Sean is for the Peter. PR. Yeah. Peter. Or That's Izzy. it. Or Izzy though. You ever think about that? 
Or is Because he's really good at it, you know what I mean? No, I already know he is. I like so. I don't know. I, I talked with him yesterday. I know when somebody likes me. <laughs> I think I have an idea when somebody likes me. But maybe he's just like playing the role because that's how he really feels deep down. Yeah, he's Wait, very he plays the role a little too guy, good. You know what I mean? What about off camera? How is he? He's super he's in same. love with Sean? Madu. Yeah, he's just like, like in love. Well, are you talking about when Madu's not around or when? <laughs> no, no, no. When no, no. When Madu's around, like off camera, is he like in love better to you? No, he just acts like my friend. Yeah, sometimes, but like he doesn't really want to make it like weird in person. Yeah, yeah I hate you I guys. I hate you guys. <laughs> you guys are. Just super nonchalant, dude. Yeah. You know what the I mean? fact he's, that you guys can lie to me with a straight <laughs> face. I will dude. say, though, you ship editors, y'all go Keep doing your thing. Keep doing your thing. They, 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 they go back from way back and they just, got like, that shit on, though. One piece, like, one piece, like they put yeah, it on. Yeah. That's, you, no, I, I've seen it before, too. I liked mm-hmm. one. Y'all had my closest <laughs> friends ask me if me and Sean were a thing. Literally, Jackie asked me, are you guys actually a thing? Esther asked me, are you guys actually a thing? Yeah. Like... People were sending me the edits, and I was like, damn, like, the way you guys edit it really makes it seem like I'm interested in this man. Like, <laughs> you guys get every time I look in his direction and, like, slow-mo that shit. That's it's crazy. Look at that's fire. That's fire. Hey, make one for Jeremy and I. <laughs> I will repost it. I will like it. I'll follow you. Please make that. Because I, I get it. to see one. That's funny. It's like Jeremy just, like, dogging us <laughs> the entire time. Like, she's smiling at him, and Jeremy's like... No, but make sure that it looks like he likes me, uh, not yeah. me liking him. Yeah, 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 you yeah, gotta yeah. manifest that there shit. There we go. You might have there to pay for that one. Okay. <laughs> hundred dollars. Whoever makes one. Venmo request you got me. me fucked up. <laughs> Wait, that answered the argument stage though in the toxic, like a toxic person, right? Um. Yeah. Yes. Okay. 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 Yes, yeah. I think. I Esther, did you so. have anything to say with that? You ever um, been in like a super toxic? Or you ever been? You've been through the argument stage, right? Mm-hmm. And you've been with a super toxic person? Yes. Was I there... agree I agree with him. Okay. Mm, yeah. Same thing. Okay, 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 okay. Mm-hmm. okay. Well, this one, I guess both the, mm, girls and guys could answer. It was mostly catered to the boys, but it was how how to make the first move as a girl. Oh. Actually, Esther, I think you can answer this because I know you've like made your first move before. So, yeah, all the time. I mean, I think it's, I, I'm not going to lie. It's easier for a girl girl to do it. Mm-hmm. Guys have it a little rougher than girls, honestly. Because if you are a decent looking girl, then you could just ask them like, hey, I think you're cute. Or like, hey, can I take you out to dinner? And they'll be like, yeah. What, do you, what, what kind of guy doesn't want to be taken out to dinner if he's what, single? What do you think like the success so? rate of a girl that's like a six out of 10? Success rate? Yeah. What do you think her success rate is? If, if he's single. If the girl is at like hitting on a dude or like calling him cute or anything like yeah, that, yeah, the guy's single. <laughs> the guy's right? single. The yeah, guy's yeah, single. Yeah, yeah. What do you think the success rate is? Six out of ten. I would honestly say, um, 80 percent, even higher. Yeah, I'll put seventy-five, eighty. I'm gonna put it. Yeah. Those are good ranges. I think oh, it, because if you're yeah. if you're literally an even a seven, bro, or eight or above, yeah. you're hitting every time. Yeah. Oh, unless eight? they're in a relationship. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Unless you're unless the guy's yeah, in a relationship, yeah, yeah. you're hitting every time. Yeah, yeah. easily, yeah. easily. But and yeah. if you hit that, like, can I take you out on dinner? Who doesn't want a free meal? Because I would say yes. That's a good point. Absolutely. Go. That's a good point. That's one way. Ask them out. Yeah. I mean, do literally do whatever's. Like, you're going to you, you win, huh? Have you been taken out and they paid for it? I've been taken out. I have not been taken out. Damn. Have y'all? Those, yeah. Those, those fucking ass. Wait, wait. You have? Yeah. With someone that's not your no, no. girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> that's not what we're talking uh, about, buddy. <laughs> That's not what we're talking he about. You want it to be different. <laughs> Your turn? No, I like being like different. No. Have mm. girls pulled the first move on any of y'all? Yeah. Yes. What was the su- success rate? Have you guys rejected any of them? Zero percent for them. Aha. <laughs> 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 okay, uh-huh. it's because you were in a relationship. <laughs> though, the right? only, yeah. The only. <laughs> 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 Imagine they're doing bruh, that in front of the bruh, girl. Bruh. Oh, no. Oh, oh you <laughs> crying. You got rejected. Oh, oh, you little loser friends. Yeah, get the hell out of here. I would cry if somebody did that. <laughs> they probably, if they were next to each other, they probably would. <laughs> no. Boo. <laughs> wow. I'm, I'm pulling all those out now. That would be so nah, funny. The only times, like, I've ever told like a girl no or like nah it was literally when I was just talking to people. Those mm. are the only times I ever said no. Really? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Very interesting. Yeah. 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 I feel like if you're single, if a guy's single and a, a six out of oh. ten yes. came up and said, like, hey, I like you, like can we go on a date? I I think he would be down for it. Open to it. Yeah. Really? A six yeah. out of ten, Nick? I think 
I'm saying, I'm saying 75 to 80%. Am I going to say yes? Probably not. But oh, wait. Not. Hey, but fine, just letting you guys so know, me. beauty is subjective, okay? Yep. Of course. A 6 out of 10 to Devin is an 8 out of 10 to me. Oh, that's a good one. Or that's vice versa. Vice, like, vice versa. versa. Ver- vice, vers- vice versa, too. I remember when Nick came on our podcast and he was like, yeah, there was this girl, she was ugly as hell, but she was smart and she was sexy. <laughs> I remember, Do you remember that. that? Oh, yeah, yeah. You're attracted like, by knowledge. Yeah, knowledge exactly. attracts me. Different things, you guys. Don't be discouraged. Yeah, no, that's true. I think if you're a girl, to be honest, you have a really good chance of... You have a very good chance of winning. Getting that guy. You have a very good chance of winning. Because a lot of us aren't going up to y'all anymore. Nah, it's we're really scared scary. now, bro. It's, also, a scary, it's a scary world now to go up to a yeah. girl. She's thinking that she'll clown you. Girls clown you. Guys usually won't clown you if you're a girl approaching him. Girls will clown you with their friends. They'll giggle sometimes. I've gotten giggled at. I think it's both. You oh. guys, you guys clown not, too. Nah, I don't there, think... there, no, there's definitely oh, some Nick, jockey I know dudes. when you were clowning. If, 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 <laughs> if it wouldn't be like in front of her though. It would be like after she leaves. After she and then and then she, he ga- you gather around all your guy friends and, well, and, guys, then, guys, 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 and then I tell the story yeah. and then we all laugh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Also, six out of ten, I feel like it's still above average. Like, yeah. you're still a good yeah. looking person. Yes. It yes, is. Yes yes, 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 yes. 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 So I lied. I would get with the six out of ten, probably ninety percent of the time. <laughs> also that's the the Sorry. crazy crazy thing is though, like the way the way Nick fumbled the baddest bitches, the baddest girls is crazy. What's his fumble Ooh. rate? Dude, my fumble rate is like What's his 90%, fumble rate, Mario? <laughs> like, it's high, And dude. I'm talking about not them fumbling. <laughs> like, Nick, he, like, he didn't want them. Wait, why? And I was like, why? Give and me then, an example okay. of a person that he fumbled. Well, Ooh. like, okay, so I, I, don't, I, I don't know exactly, like, their names or how they look like. But why but, didn't you? Maude about- giving me like that post game interview talk where she's like, "How the fuck did you fuck it up <laughs> yeah. with this person?" Literally, like she was fine, yeah. she had a job, like all that shit, and I was like, "Damn!" And then he showed me the text message, and I was like, "Okay, that kind of makes sense." Oh, okay, okay. Like you know There's when they're kind of when they're kind of like mm. they want more, like they tend to be crazy. More what? More like um, res- like faster responses, like even oh. though you guys aren't like together, together. Ah. Oh. Question. Yes. Is it a red flag um, when you guys see a new dude and he says that either all his exes or his past ex was crazy? Like just offering. Yeah, that's oh, a red flag. Course. Why do you guys think that's a red flag? Like, why do you guys not think that it's true? Because, bro, what's more likely that he every time he meets and gets with a crazy girl or him just like making them crazy yes. or lying about? But does that them depend being crazy? on how? What many? about him? Right? Like, what about exactly. him? Why? Why were a lot of the times when I talk to guys and they're like, "Yeah, this girl's crazy," I read their text messages and I'm like. What the fuck are you doing? Why are you talking like this to her? And then I'm just like, no, nah, she's not crazy. You, you made, made her, her trip. You right. made her trip. So I, that's why I'm just like, yeah, no. If a guy is saying their ex, like all of his exes are crazy, I'm just like, no, nah, something's wrong with you. Maybe, maybe like it's it's it could be 50-50, mm-hmm. but don't be blaming everything on her. Oh, okay. Fact. You or made like, her feel so that like way. If he says like his past one, just the past one was crazy. That's a little bit different, but he's like, if he was saying something like, oh, no, all my past exes were crazy. Yeah. 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 But even one ex, I, I don't even call my exes crazy. Even if they were toxic, I was like, yeah, I mean, we both, I would say sometimes it was 50 50, right? Uh, I, I'm not saying like, oh, I was like all innocent and he was the toxic one. But yeah, like if he's telling, if he's saying that his ex is crazy, then what is he going to say about you when you guys break up? He's going to say you're crazy oh, too. Oh, for sure. Literally, it's Damn. just. Also, yeah also for me it's like i got to experience like seeing both sides of the story mm-hmm. so it's like this person would tell me oh she was crazy but then i talk to that person and then like i hear their their side and i'm like talking, talking, yeah. to the, talking to the ex you're talking to the ex oh well i'm talking about like my friend guy oh friends. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. i'm not talking about people i'm talking to it's mostly got like it. guy friends that tell me oh my exes were all crazy and then you're like nah bro like you made her crazy yes sometimes yeah. when they tell me the situations they would tell on themselves and I'm like, hold on. Like, I don't know. Maybe I think <laughs> yeah. it was you. I think you were the problem. I don't even need to talk to the girl. But um, yeah, so I've always take note if somebody yep. says stuff like that. Takes two to tangle, y'all. Don't only listen to one side of the story. Yep. Um, yep. I never thought about that before. But then I, I like a couple months ago, uh, we had a friend who was like talking about how all, all his exes were crazy. And I was like. I, all of them yeah, i'm like yeah, yeah. i'm like all of them bro and then but i don't know so i, I know i don't know usually gotta take my guys i think though. i know who, what friend you're talking about i literally oh. told him i was like eh, that's not too bad were they <laughs> were they crazy or did you make them crazy i literally told him that 
I think I think a lot of dudes make girls crazy. I'm yeah. not gonna lie. I think a lot of dudes yeah. just because they're so like unaware of things yeah. and they don't want they don't want to think deeper. I think yeah. I think I think that's literally the root of the problem is like dudes just don't want to think deeper really with a lot of things. Yeah. Sometimes I think some guys do that on purpose because they like making girls seem crazy yeah, some of them the toxic ones yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, they get off from that that's why do you think it's like that manipulation type thing where it's like i have this control over her to make Definitely her crazy yeah. or to like me you know what i mean yeah right. like blue face i feel like he does that shit on purpose to irk like oh Kishan. that's he's so disgusting yeah another, i think he's, so he's, so he's doing that for cloud he's like no, 100%. No. yeah i think he's doing it for i think he, he takes advantage of it in any way yeah, yeah, which yeah. is like really bad and disgusting yeah 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 what else exactly what are you talking about yeah, oh, yeah, I, um, I was right. gonna say though, nah, cause like the way I see it is like, let's say, okay, I think a lot of girls think very deeply about ev everything in a sense, right? So no matter what I do, no matter if I'm doing this unintentionally, I think girls look at it in a deeper sense, right? Mm -hmm. And it's kind of like, well, if I'm dating with this person, I should automatically know how she's gonna think. You get what I mean? So it's not like, even if my intention isn't is ha completely uh, harmless and mm -hmm. it, I'm not trying to be like, hurt her or get her mad or anything, I should st I'm still in a position where I should be thinking more deep on that. You get what I mean? Mm -hmm. And I think a lot of dudes are just stupid. Like they don't really care enough to go that deep. You know what I mean? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's how I see you, it. That's you actually, I, I think you hit that on the nail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. That's why you guys are yeah. good guys. Bro hit that with his head. Hey, yeah. I, you know, I make my mistakes too, but. Yeah. But I think you guys I'm are living you learn. I think y'all because we had conversations yeah. where like I think you guys think like three steps ahead though too of like where this will come out. In and it's like you know what yes. you know what I mean. Like I won't do this or I'll step back. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Good guys, right? Here. You think it depends on like how much you care about the person? Yes, absolutely, one hundred percent. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. Okay, mm. should we do a fun question now? Yeah, let me hear okay. it. Up to okay. you. What A-list celebrity would you guys choose to be on the pod? On the pod. Ooh. Ryan Reynolds. <clears throat> oh, he would be a good one. Ryan Reynolds off know. rip. Johnny Depp. That's a great pick. What is the reason? Johnny. I'm curious. He's the poop. man. Did she really do it? Did she really do it? Did mm. she really poop on the bed? She did um, do it. You think so? She did do it. Amber she pooped heard. on the bed? And you could take Johnny Depp. You didn't hear about that? <laughs> I didn't Amber hear it. Heard. Tell me the story. The well, they used to get into a fight, and one day uh, Amber Heard pooped on his bed. Pooped on the bed and like left it there. That's fucking wild. Wait, you've never heard of this? Never heard of it. It's this disgusting. Story. I heard about Amber Heard and the whole Johnny case. Yeah. Um, yeah. Who mm. would I want on the podcast? I want to touch Ryan I got, Reynolds' beard. I got one more good one. And Chester. <laughs> Sorry. I feel like actually she's not a. a Hugh a Jackman. That's I want Hugh so? Jackman here That's too. A great pick, Nick. I want to touch Hugh Jackman. I'm gonna go Jack Black. I was gonna say that too. I was gonna say that's that. That's such a fire pick. I feel like he's super like oh he has a lot God. of wisdom and he's so like funny, funny. And just comedic. Yeah. I thought Jack Black was Mexican for the longest time. Because <laughs> of know. Nacho, yeah, Nacho yeah, yeah, yeah. I did not know he was white. Oh what? What about you, Maru? I'm still thinking. Yeah, me too. There's so many like, options. I have one, but I'm like she's not an A-list celebrity. I was gonna say Trisha Paytas. Oh, really? She's hilarious. Honestly, that's a fire. She's fire so pick fucking still. funny. And then on top of that, um, I was like, Julia Fox is funny too. I mean, she's she's interesting. Ju is she the one that's like um, uncut gems? Yeah. Is it that one? Okay, okay, okay. Uncut gems. Um, damn. Adam, Adam Sandler. Sandler. Hey, damn. Oh, oh, Adam Sandler. Sandler. That is a fire pick too. No, no girls. I'm thinking Dwayne the Rock Johnson. I want to touch I him too. Gonna I was gonna say Dwayne. <laughs> I want to see if he's me real. Too, too, I want. I want to know if he's real or not. Yeah. How hard is he? <laughs> <laughs> is he as hard as a rock? Is he as hard as a rock? That's, That's all real. I want to know. Dwayne, if you're watching this, are you as hard as a rock right now? <laughs> yeah. We need to know. <laughs> we need to know. Mr. Johnson, are you hard as yeah. a rock? As a rock. Let us know in the comments. Yeah. <laughs> he comments yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the check mark. I'll try to. I'll try to think of. Um, Megan the Stallion would be really fun. Oh, she would, she would be. She would be good. I would be so stuttering all the, over my words. Oh, I got one. Yeah. Shakira. I would watch Shakira would be, on this podcast. Uh, all these girls, I would be stuttering um, and sweating so much. Dude, I got one really good. I just can't think of it. I right feel like now. Shakira has a lot of knowledge. Yeah. Yeah. I'd ask her, what happened with you and PK? Yeah. Yeah. She goes, Rabiosa. Oh. <laughs> Maybe Will Smith. Oh, that would be. Ooh. That's a fire move. Yeah, he, I has, got right now, he has though, too, right now. He has too hey, much shit going on that would be shit. funny. Did you guys yeah. see that, that <laughs> That's stuff a great like, about his like best friend going on a podcast, like outing his business and how yes. he said that he was getting back shots from. Yes. Whoa. Yeah, what? from his yes. like Will Smith was taking back shots from. I, I believe it. Uh, he said it. I don't know. Don't quote me. I heard back shots, but I heard it was with um, Martin. 
Martin, the dude from Bad uh, the Bo Bad Boys. Who's in that movie with him? Dude, Martin. He has, he has the goatee. The dude from uh, Bad Boys in the movie Bad Boys with Will Smith and Martin. Bro, I know who you're talking about. I know him. Dwayne Martin. Martin. Mar no, it's Martin something. I don't know. I don't know if it was him, but he came out like it was his best friend and assistant, and he was saying that he walked in on Will Smith yeah, getting yeah, back yeah. shots from this dude. But he was saying some wild shit though. He was saying that I think he. I don't know if the secu I mean the assistant said it or Jada said it, but they were like, um, "Will Smith can never satisfy me," and I, I was yeah, like, yeah. I, "I I don't know who said that, but that's wild that his best friend would do that to him. Like, why? Weird. That's what I'm saying. Like, why would why would he be lying? But then I'm like, okay, but for clout though, maybe you know what I mean. But just nothing, bro. It just goes on a full I don't podcast. Know. If I would, <laughs> I'll sound bad. He's not sound bad at all. That's the that's the weird part. To get clout right now, Will Smith is like he was the hero. He's my hero. You know, dude. I, like no, I used day. to idolize Will Smith, bro. Will Smith was like the one guy that I wanted to be. Yeah. Not anymore. <laughs> no. But it's just weird how somebody would say that if he wanted to have the publicity for that. You know. I think maybe because he. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's true. Maybe it's not true. Wait, what's wrong know. with getting back shots though? No, no, nothing's wrong with it. But I'm saying like, why would he have to have that like extreme? Like, like, why is he like, out in the business? Yeah, why is he out, why like, is he out oh, in the business? Yeah. The friend, the friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah. Friend and assistant, like, why is he out in the business? Mm. Damn, yeah, I feel bad pretty, for Will Smith. That's, that's He's been going like, through a lot these yeah, past private. years. Yeah, it's very private. Yeah. And his marriage, bro, his marriage is out there. It's like, that's something that's extremely private. You, that mm -hmm. should never be out there. Yeah. Just adding fuel to the flame. Yeah. Maybe Jada teamed up with oh. his best friend and said, you know what? I'm getting all this backlash from people. They, I want to, I want people to go for will now you know and be like yeah he couldn't satisfy me as man because he liked men i don't know damn you know she might be she she's might a be super villain, villain. She might, yeah she might be, be a super him, villain yeah you know why would she be with him it makes sense i don't know i'm not gonna lie jada you look like a terrible person though you do <laughs> yeah you do she looks she's beautiful Tupac. to me <laughs> but no, what no, I no, no. Oh. <laughs> not, not just just a terrible oh, person is okay. what i'm saying <laughs> <laughs> I thought you meant like, oh, she looks like a supervillain, like physically. Uh, she she kind of looks like a supervillain too. <laughs> With celebrities, I I can never tell, so I'm just like, I don't know you, but it's not looking good for you. Yeah, is what yeah. I say. Yep. No, nah, that's crazy. Yeah. I, I would also pick <coughs> Hasbula. 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 <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Imagine that would be so fun. <laughs> I'd be scared. I would be kind of scared too. I would be, I would be very oh, scared. Oh, to have him on the That'd podcast? Crazy. Oh. Can he speak English? No. no. Either translate. way, that shit's blowing up. Mm -hmm. Conor McGregor. Yeah. Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor. I would love podcast. to sit across Conor That's McGregor a, yeah. and have a convo with that man. I'd probably I'd be, be asking what yeah. so many times. Though. Oh, yeah, definitely. What'd you say? Yeah. <laughs> I'd be scared with him. Conor yeah. McGregor? Yeah. Doesn't he roast people all the time? Or like, he's Maybe really he good at roasting? Yeah. Yeah. He'll say anything. He'll get into it with y'all. Say yeah, the wrong thing. Absolutely. Oh, he'll say like, "What'd you say?" I'll shut up. Yeah, I'll shut up. I'll shut the fuck yeah, up. Yeah. No, I'm not roasting him at all. <laughs> Who the fuck is that guy? Yeah. Who the fuck <laughs> is that guy? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm good. Okay, <sighs> dude. There's gotta be somebody that we're missing. Dude, crazy. that's what I'm saying. Somebody uh, that like really hits on. Huh? Yeah. Dinner with Jay Z. That's 500k. Fuck no. Y'all, the P Diddy Cassie shit. Oh, Yo, I was talking to him about it. I was talking to him yeah. about it. Can you guys you explain know? it? I've been scrolling, so I I don't really. Who got it? Ooh, you want to explain P. Diddy it? Diddy is a bad bad man. What he do? You know he's a billionaire, right? Mm -hmm. Like he yeah. literally has the whole world in his hand, mm -hmm. and he's been dating Cassie for over 10 years, a long long time. But she was 19 when he was 37. When weird. they started off, dating, off that weird. See, I may yeah. I may get the mm -hmm. info wrong, so correct me. But this is how I know it. And um, he, when they were dating, he would make her do all sorts of weird shit. Like he's into, uh, what is it called? Fuck offs. He call it. He would he would call them fuck offs. So like he would hire like male prostitutes to fuck her, and he would watch. Oh, he's jack a off. Yeah, yeah, oh, he's yeah. A he's a yeah, yeah. And he would he would record. Right? Record and take record. pictures. Yeah. So, Weirdo. yeah, so basically, like, blackmail. That was his, like, fetish, whatnot. What else did he do? Um, if he saw any male uh, talking to Cassie, he would, like, do something with their career. Um, he blew up Kid Cudi's car. Yeah, because Kid yeah. Cudi was supposed to leave. Because they were, I think her and Diddy were, like, on a break or separated. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And then she started talking to Kid Cudi, and he blew up Kid Cudi's car. Yeah. What? He also yeah. got his... And he said it was true. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
He admitted it. Yeah. That's no, crazy. No, uh, Kid Cudi said it was true. Oh, yeah, yeah. Kid Cudi said it was true. And then he also got like one of her friends and like dangles her off the balcony or something yeah. Yeah. from like a really high up building. He Jackson. did that a couple times. He did that a couple times. Dang. It was another, I think it was another dude that another talked dude. to Cassie I saw that. and then he yeah. dangled him across like off some the balcony. Rapper. Like, a whale. Even... Wall yeah, yeah, Wale, yeah, Wale, 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 Wale. Wale. yeah, yeah, it was Sorry. Wale. What the fuck did Wale do? Bro, that's, no, no, that, you know, that's <laughs> why people were saying that's why Wale didn't have the career that he had because he, because he had someone made sure that he yeah. didn't exactly. like have a career. Exactly. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah, but dude, there was other things like there was instances where like so supposedly like he would just have Cassie like drugged up like all the time and she was like oh, dependent yeah. on drugs yeah, yeah, yeah. and like there was an instance where he told um someone overheard him tell her like oh shave the side of your head just just cause cause. Oh, no, 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 this is what happened. He saw a girl, a pretty girl with the shaved head, looked over at Cassie and said, yo, shave your head like that. Oh, God. And she shaved it. She shaved half, half of her head. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I believe her, and honestly. Then I guess, yeah, and then I guess the dude like had said something like, oh, like you're just doing that? Like, Is that not weird that he looked at her and then told you to do that? And she was like, whatever Diddy wants, like, I'll do it. No, yeah, I believe it because I've seen a lot of interviews where people say like Diddy is a horrible person. Mm -hmm. Yeah. He's mm -hmm. he's abusive. He's like anger. He has anger issues. I mean, honestly, I feel like that would be the case for a lot of rich men. Oh yeah, they really have nice. so much power. It's just like man, that shit's scary. But it's yeah. like, but it's like, why? You it's know just because I, mean? like, like, I think like, when you, you know, have like when you know, ten billion dollars, and you were to like shit on me for like doing something, I'd be like, yo, fuck you. Like, what the fuck? I think it's just when you head, know, man, you're, yeah, when you know head. you're on top of the world and you have so much control, like you take advantage of it. Regular shit is not fun anymore. Like regular sex yeah. is not fun. You want to do something crazy. That's why can. a lot and of billionaires be having sex with children and they be having sex with like, I mean, they be having like the weirdest. Yeah. And I feel like once you realize you can get it that easy, yeah. like you're just going to keep doing it. Yeah. Yeah. Do more than what you, you know yeah, what I mean? That's yep. crazy. Bro. No, yeah. it's, it's actually disgusting. Yeah. And Esther just spoke facts. Squid Games is honestly very much real. It has to be real. It had like similar like that. Yeah. Like shit starts getting more into them. They start doing some evil shit. Speaking, yeah. Speaking of crazy shit, just real quick. Y'all see what happened in San Francisco with the homeless population? No. No. Y'all ain't heard about it? So the the Chinese president came to visit San Francisco just to, I don't know why. He just came over. And you know how San Francisco has a crazy yes. homeless problem? So... They, in one night, took care of all the homeless people. Like, people were talking and taking videos about how, like, there is no more homeless people in San Francisco. Like, from where the president came. I don't know if they're back now, now that the president's gone. But people were, like, one day they were here, overnight, all the homeless people were, like, gone. Like, they were taken away. And people were talking about, oh, how they saw buses come by, picking up the homeless people, but they had no idea where they went. People are talking about how, like, they haven't heard from certain people that were homeless, like, in a while. Yeah, yeah, you guys... Uh -uh. All over my TikTok. Wait, the like the leader of China, like yes. Xi Jinping. Yes, he came to, to San, San Francisco. Francisco. What's he? Do you think he took them back to China, or somehow got rid of? Are them they still money? here? Oh, I don't know <laughs> now. I just know that literally overnight they were all gone. You can look it up on TikTok. That's, what? That's really scary. Yeah. And and but the other thing two people were saying were like the the trippiest thing though is that no one got footage like of that night. Like no one saw the homeless yeah. people like all fucking dipping. You get what I mean? Yeah. I don't know. Crazy yeah. shit's going that on. Shit's pretty lit about it. That shit has hella lights over there. Mm -hmm. so you, it's fucking San Francisco. That, yeah. How come I didn't see it? That's crazy. Look it yeah. up on TikTok, dude. It's, it's fucking crazy. crazy. Bro, the world scares me sometimes. I'm mm -hmm. like. Mm -hmm. Anyways, I'm sorry. Talking about Diddy in San Francisco. That got if somebody, real dark. If, if somebody came up to you and was like, I have all the secrets to everything, do you want Fuck to tell no. me? Tell me. Fuck <laughs> no. Tell me everything. But I, you I, would be I don't think, yeah, I don't think I would want to know. Tell me everything. Like, would I have to do something? Nah, you just have that knowledge. So just do just. Yeah, I wouldn't believe it. Why would oh, I believe? Dude, it? I feel like I'm dead after that though. But like, you let's would say never like, be you the same. Caught, I'm saying like it's like a CIA type of thing. Oh, he's like, oh, you yeah, just yeah, want to yeah. know everything, bro? Yeah. Tell me. Fuck no. I'll be. No. Uh, tell me a little bit. You would never. <laughs> you would never <laughs> tell me two secrets. Wait, no, no. You have to know all or nothing. I think yeah. that's that's that's. Oh, that's give me it. Give me it. I don't know if I want that. Give me it. Give me it all. Fucked up world. I'm itching. Give me it all. Yeah. It's it's. There's something in the back of my mind that's telling me like I'm I have to. I'm man. I want to know everything. Oh, yeah. nah. Ignorance is bliss. But low key, yes, yes. Tell me. I'm ready to learn. Dude, After see. I found some dark shit out about the world, I like was never the same. It's like un almost like unbelievable, right? It's Very just unbelievable. Like, what the fuck? Mm -hmm. And it, it's like traumatizing. I still think right. about it. You know I'm what? Like, I will say no. though, shout out TikTok because TikTok does be exposing me to a lot of it things. Do. Yeah, like do. a lot, lot of, of things. It do. Shout Dude, I don't know if I'd want that information. Yeah, I don't it's think I want it. Uh, uh, I feel like that would just be like, like, I don't know, blood on my hands at that point. Yeah, you know? yeah. tell yeah. me. 
I don't know. No. <laughs> Nick, you're crazy. You're so insane. That, like, what if they tell you something's going to happen, and then, like, Can't, like it, you do anything? it happens, but, like, you knew? You knew. You just couldn't do anything about it. Can't do anything It's, about like, it. catastrophic for, like, your family, everybody. You can't do anything about it. Jeez. But I still know. <laughs> Jeez. At least I know what, what, what happened, though. You know what I mean? Well, imagine, like, you knew and you didn't give the warning. And then it happened. Well, why would I? Why wouldn't I give the warning? I'm just saying. Right? You oh, die. Shit happens. Huh? You probably die. Yeah. I'd still give the warning. And I'd die, die knowing everything in the world. It's only like a think great time. Life wouldn't be fun if you knew everything that's yeah. gonna yeah. happen. That's true. Like sure. the whole purpose of life is to go through it and like without knowing what's gonna Fuck happen. Fuck that. Tell me what's gonna happen tomorrow, the next day, <laughs> no. the next day. Tell me all it. Hell. I agree no. with that, Steve. I. Yeah. That just reminds me. I I I had this dream one time where like. I could find, I had the ability to know when I would die or not. Ooh. What was the date? Wait, well, what? You said you had a dream? Yeah. I just, you like, you, you guys, die. yeah. No, no, but like in that dream, it was like a dystopian like society where like you could choose to know when exactly you die or not, but I didn't. I wouldn't want to know either. Yeah. If I gave you an envelope mm -hmm. and I was like, this is the day that you die and how you die. You looking at it? You throwing it away? You keeping it? Are you keeping it? I'm, I'm throwing look, it away. I might look at it. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm you guys look looking at, at it? it? No. It says tomorrow. Smiley face. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are going to fear for your life every single day. Exactly. If well, you find out. Well, like, really I have a question. I have a question. Oh, what, okay, if, what, if, what if it was just the date? But like, wouldn't you just like avoid the way how you die? What if it was just the date? What if it was just the date? Just the date. Just the date. No. No. Oh, just the date? Just the date. You wouldn't look at it? Hell no. What if it was how? How you die? It, uh, no, might, no, might just because. So you can try and you can't, can't avoid even avoid it. I'm like, it. I'm like, brother, here's the envelope, but you cannot avoid this. Sage, what is the dude, point of that? There's no point. That's that's the the worst part. There's no point in doing it. To prepare yourself, I guess. Like, I don't I know. Guess, if it was like, if it was like in an airplane, would you ever hop no. on a plane? No, that's again? what I'm saying. And then I would die differently. Maybe no, airplane hits me then. Oh shit! It's like by an airplane. Is that a bird? <laughs> the weird I'm not bird. looking at it. I'm not looking at it either. Yeah, I'd, I'd burn it. I'd keep it. I'd keep it. I'd keep it. Keep you would keep it? I think I'd keep it. Nah. I'd be like, that you look at it. I'd accidentally look <laughs> Wait, at it. Wait, why the heck you say you want to know all the secrets of the world, but well, you don't want to know? I don't want to know how I die, but I want to know how other people died. <laughs> Nick. Yeah. What? Yeah. No, nah, I would keep it though, because then like, let's say, let's say in the future I get a disease or something like that. Like, let's say I get cancer. Yeah. God forbid. Yeah. I could look at it and be like, it says like, die, yeah, it says like, die of cancer. Then I could be like, oh, fuck, like, this is it for me. Or I could be like, oh, I survived this. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's how I'm saying it. I True. keep it. That's a great point. Mm -hmm. I think I would do the same as Nick. Mm -hmm. You can't change your fate. If, if it said, no, that's like, what you're I'm saying. Like, cancer, if it's yeah. cancer, though, I'd say, like, oh, yeah, like, this is it. I'm going to start saying my goodbyes. You know, like, I'm not beating it. You know what I mean? Oh, I see, Dude, okay. could you imagine, like, that's not it, though? You just look at it and it says, like, car accident. Yeah. That'd be crazy, right? Then I'd be like, oh, maybe I will beat this. You know what I mean? That's true. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. That's that's what I'm thinking. I'm big brain in that. True. It's like my my kids are like running around one day and they open up the envelope. Daddy, what does car dad mean? <laughs> yeah. what? Car. <laughs> dead by car. <laughs> January 9th. <laughs> Isn't today the 9th? <laughs> oh, shit. No. oh, my God. Anyways, <laughs> go ahead, Mario. Okay, next question is, what does it truly mean when somebody keeps coming back? God, that doesn't mean shit sometimes. Especially when a man comes back, it's just like he's just either bored or like I don't think a lot of the time I don't think he truly changed. I think he just wants to come back because he knows that you're gonna take him back. Hundred percent. Everything I was thinking she just said. I have a question. Do you guys believe um like if someone comes like running back or comes back, it means that they couldn't do better? Mm. Oh, that could be yeah, part of it too. Yeah, that could be a reason that, as well. That could be a reason. Do you think that's the main reason why? Is because like whether you, uh, whether let's say they break up with you or they whatever's, yeah. and then they come back. Do you think it's because they couldn't do better or they know that they can't do better? You got know what I mean? Have you ever gone back to a girl or asked? Okay, so why did you go back to her? <laughs> no, I didn't. No, you I didn't. didn't. I, did. I, was, I was thinking. What no, about no. you guys? No, never. I so like once you guys broke yeah, up, but like you guys never, never like, went back. If I were to use an instance, it would be my girlfriend right now, but it was never for like. Because I think like people will go with that so fast. Like they'll be like a month of them not talking. Oh, I'm going to go back to them. Oh. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like I hear that all the time. They didn't, they didn't fully uh, heal yeah, or like, get like over shit that. like that. Oh, That's I what see, I, I see, hear. I see, I see. Yeah, yeah, but no, but I meant like. Long, long time. Okay, I yeah. see, I see. What about you? I have. 
And how long was the break till you went back? The longest? Yeah. Uh, it's like almost like a year. So you went back to her after a year? Yeah. Why? <clears throat> well, I, actually, I didn't. Co- <clears throat> it was like mutual. Now that I think about it. And you oh. guys are. S- <laughs> why'd you leave? Um, I think at the time, though, I wanted to go back, but then I realized I need the healing. So, like, I did my own thing and it was like going really well, but then, like, I don't know. We both kind of like reached out to each other and was like, let's just try it again. But it wasn't like definitely like not like a power move or anything. Oh, okay. I've never been like a part of that, but I'm trying to like get like yeah, the, I'm trying the, to like the, um, um, the, I've the had the most common one. So right? I've had people that have tried to get back with me and in the most like serious way. And I maybe I'm a cynical person. It's I feel like it's usually because they know that they can't do better. <sighs> like they like because like usually that's what happens. Because I feel like if you have a relationship with somebody. And you're with them for a long time, whatever is right, or a year, two years, six months, and then y'all break up, and, and it's either it's the person that's breaking up with them, it's the and you you want to come back, that person that broke up with you, it's because you could not find better. Let, let's be real. Why else are you coming back? Unless yeah, unless like it's like oh, you guys spread apart. You're like oh, like if it's for the better, we'll come back to each other eventually. Like, Valid. Yeah. It is mutual. Saying, it yeah, is yeah. mutual for sure. That's kind of that's kind of how it was yeah. when I did that's it. Fine. That's yeah. fine. That's fine. But I'm saying if it's one sided and they come back though, yeah, yeah, yeah. that's usually that's, what it is though because yeah. they could okay, not. Okay, if it's one sided, yeah, yeah, that's one sided. Yeah, I agree. I've been the person that's went back multiple and times. Why? And it's usually because okay, like the first time I did it with that first person, um, it was because. The reason why I broke up with that person was because it was too toxic. So it wasn't because I lost feelings or anything like that. And so, like, it, I missed him so bad that, like, I would have to hit him up. It was real bad. And then the second... But it was never because I didn't think I could do better. No, that's... that's, that's that makes sense. Okay. Yes, yeah. and then the second one that I kept going back, I didn't even really like him that much, but I missed his presence. So, like, yeah, that's why I would hit him up. And I know that's selfish, but it was never because, like... <clears throat> couldn't find anyone better or anything like that i just missed that person yeah question Mm -hmm. did you do this when you were younger like the the first one probably i'm assuming oh that one yeah and that was high school and then the second one was like beginning of college yeah yeah i feel yeah i definitely feel like that's like a a younger thing to do like really miss somebody or like am i well no no oh or like uh what was the first one you had the toxicness yeah like leaving somebody because they were too toxic yeah it's fine though too those are the hardest man that's true, because you still like them. Right. But exactly. you're like, I I have to for myself. Exactly. Yeah. Damn. I feel like, though, um, I don't know why, but when I look at it from a man's perspective, though, and they keep constantly coming back in my head, I'm like, nah, you're just coming back because you think I'm going to take you back, you know? Yeah. So, mm-hmm. I don't know. For you girls out there, I still say stand your ground and say no. Mm-hmm. I still respond to their text. I think say? it's funny. What do you say? They're like, oh, can we? Can no, we I haven't done it like recently, but huh? like, um, yeah, they'll be like, hey, like I've seen you on the podcast or whatever. Like, oh, <laughs> you're doing really well. I'll be like, thanks. And then <laughs> they're just like, oh, so like they'll try to like start a conversation and then I'll just ghost them. It's just it's just funny to respond and just like valid. ghost. No, definitely. That's funny. valid. No, that's funny like as fuck that. though. Thank you for boosting my ego, but now I have to go. <laughs> I like this that one. That is crazy. If any of my exes <laughs> That's a power move. I like that came one. to me and said like, oh, seeing you on the podcast. Um, see, you're doing good or something like that. I'm going to be like, bro. Can we do good together? Oh, oh <laughs> fuck no. I'm going to be like, what? You got to get on. Hey, hey, you check out my uh, <laughs> my highlights yet? Can you, can you put me in your bio? Oh, oh fuck my no. God. Oh, oh no. my God. It's like, now that you see that I'm up, you want to hit me up? Like, bye. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, though, that's what I think. Sorry. That's what like old friends too. I'm not going to lie. I totally took it off trajectory. What was the main question though? Oh, the, if if someone comes back, what is the real reason? Yeah. Oh. oh. We were on topic. Was that the same topic? Yeah, right? Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. So, That's my that was my take. That was my take on it. Yes. Wait, what was it? I zoned out. What well, you answered. Yeah, they're just okay. lonely. There's like a lot of reasons, but I think that a lot of the times it's just you shouldn't take them back. Mm-hmm. I agree. Oh yeah. Leave the past in the past, man. How else are you gonna move past. forward? Dude, Period. Past. Slay. 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 Facts. Mm. Should we do one more question? Uh, we should probably do a couple more. A couple. Okay. Yeah. Don't we stop at uh, one thirty? Yeah, but there's some time that we still have because I started earlier. Okay. Okay. Somebody asked, 
How do you trust someone that cheated on someone else? Ooh. Ooh. Do y'all think about that? If you like get with oh, somebody shit. that some you, about that. you know cheated on somebody else, would it like make you view them differently? Friend wise or like like a significant other wise? Because um, I have friends that have cheated. Oh, I'm telling with that. Yeah. Yeah. Which I'm just like, man, you shouldn't have done that. Yeah, but I'm but, not it doesn't make yeah. me trust them any less yeah, though. Yeah. yeah. I think this girl was asking more so like relationship wise. Relationship yeah. wise? I'm I would I be know. I wouldn't be able to. Really? Even if it wasn't on you, makes sense. I wouldn't be able to. I firmly believe that people can change, mm-hmm. but um, I probably wouldn't give them the chance, right? But but I I feel like but I I do believe that they can. Mm-hmm. I just personally wouldn't want to go through that myself. Period. No, yeah, because it's like you're already going into that relationship thinking something badly, negative of them, like yeah. oh they can hurt me. Like that would have to be Does. mentioned in the very beginning you have to tell me like why it happened like why you did it and then i have to like i don't know i gotta gotta come back and collect all my thoughts yeah because like what if she says something like um what if she says like oh like he wasn't really showing me like the attention that i wanted or needed i'd be like well what happens if i don't do that yeah like if i'm in a weird place where i can't i think that's a bullshit reason by the way you think i've heard that that's why yeah 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 any reason for cheating is bullshit i think yeah um the time span matter like what if you're like 26 and i did it i was like 18. Oh, that's, fine. Uh, that's what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, is that easy okay. breeze over there? Yeah, yeah, I think. Or I think, are you still thinking about I it? I think the only time frame matters is like if you were young when you did it. Okay. Because like if I'm, if they were like 26 and I'm like 30, 32, I'm still like you're still a grown woman though. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. If you're like okay. set 18, 19, 20, 21, even pushed to 22, I'd be like, okay, like that's cool. Like you were young, like that's totally fine. But yeah, though yeah. I think the older you get, the more it should not be okay. Yeah. At time, all. time does matter, yeah. Because I've done some dumb shit when I was younger, and True. now I'm just like, holy fuck, why did I do that? So yeah. like, we do learn, and we do change. True. So I, yeah, I believe that. Um, what about if there's there's a girl and a guy, right? The girl cheated on the guy, and so the guy was like, I'm gonna cheat on her. No. No. Okay. Nah. I'll tell Vit that. Yeah. What about you? What are you, about you, Esther? If somebody did would that, would I? Would I? No, no. I think I was like, why would you do what you didn't want that person to exactly. do? Yeah, no, yeah. Exactly. No. Exactly. 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 But Vit was young, so. Yeah. Nah. Yeah. When I hear that, I just think one, like you're a hypocrite, and then two, you're a cheater too. Like, how are you gonna get yeah, mad at somebody and then do the same thing? Mm. Yeah. It's just I mean, like a revenge are, type. shit. You are yeah. a cheater too yeah. if you do that. So mm-hmm. you're no better than the person that hurt you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's the way scares I do. Me. Yeah. Right? It fucking scares me, bro. It's like, how? I don't know how. You, I'm, I'm going to be real with you, Mario. You you a true, bro. I don't know how you recovered from that. <sighs> wait, how many times? Oh. You have to think? Really? Okay, wait, hold on. Oh, my God. This is so embarrassing. I didn't even know that. Really? I thought it was only once. No. It was like, okay, two people, but like the last one, bro, it was multiple times. Dang. Okay, but like the thing is, though, like I found out only after at once that he did it multiple times you know what i mean yeah but yeah. that would still just be like oh my god i just i don't know how i don't know how you, rec- how you honestly i don't even know if i recovered i haven't been in a relationship since i don't know how i'm gonna act in a new relationship so we'll see if i did god we'll see if i healed but yeah fuck cheaters i'm on the same boat as y'all wouldn't even touch that if mm. i found out they like cheated on their last person so girl don't even did we even answer her question what was your question <laughs> She was like, how to deal oh, with how it? To, oh, you can't, oh, damn. man. How you do we can't. Cut? I don't oh. Well, you can. You, you can. can. I, think, I think that that has to be like an hour to like three hour conversation <laughs> yeah, where dude. we're both breaking yeah, bread and, it's and gonna drinking be wine. More, and it's going to be more conversations after yep, that. Yep. And I'm it's not just going to be going. one conversation. And also, bro, you know what? I will say this, though. If you are somebody that did cheat um, and you want to be with somebody that needs that trust from you, you got to reassure them. A lot out the fucking ass, oh, bro. Sure. Like it doesn't matter how annoying it is, how bothered you are, you gotta keep reassuring them. Yeah, for sure. This is my advice to you, girl. If it's like a new relationship, I say it's not worth it, just because you're always gonna have trust issues already. But if you're already deep into it, listen to what Nick said. Yeah, yeah. like y'all yeah, yeah. need to talk that shit out, and you guys need to like understand where, yeah, where it came from, or like uh, why he did it. Bring that up in your next relationship. Did you cheat on your that? No, no, no. Oh. Would you be like, I got this done to me, and I might have a little bit of, you know what I mean? Um, we'll see where it goes. If like I'm healed by then, and I don't seem to act in any crazy way, then like mm-hmm. I'm good. But mm-hmm. if I'm like acting crazy and I'm aware of it, I'm gonna tell him. 
this mm. is why. Yeah, I, I think know. that's a valid point to make too, though. Like, if you do feel a certain way yeah. from your past, because I feel like your partner should care enough about you to like understand that. And, they like, should know that. Yeah, and know yeah. know it and understand it. So like, if you are feeling a certain way, give you that reassurance. Like, yeah, you don't need to feel this way because I'm different. Whatever. Yeah. Have you guys been with anybody that's been cheated on either once or multiple times? No. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. a good question. Yeah. Um, no, never. Never someone that's got cheated on. Oh. No. Yes. Cheated on. Oh, you were with the guy that has been cheated on. Yeah. Okay. How was that? Was oh. he a cheater too? He was the one who cheated on me like multiple times. <laughs> what a dick What the fuck? Oh my God. No, I'm telling you, some of these men, that's bro, crazy. they get hurt once and they go on this super villain arc and uh, do some crazy shit. Like, bro, like, uh, chill. It, it makes a man, dude. <laughs> it, it does make a man. Now, you don't have to cheat, but I think every that's happened to every fucking dude. Bro, like, Dude, that is the yeah. biggest Man. hypocritical shit ever. Like, now that's woo! bad. That's really bad to be cheated on. Yeah, you know what's crazy? He was probably, like, telling everybody, like, how much it hurt him, everything, and then he did it. Dude, that's I would crazy. lose. You know, I mean? you know what? You know how we like, talked about, you know how we talked about, like, our friends that cheat? Mm-hmm. I would lose, and I, I've always, like, and I still do believe where I'd be like, yeah. I wouldn't, like, fucking not be your friend anymore. Yeah. yeah. Um, and I'd lose a little respect. I would lose, actually, all my respect if my friend got cheated on. Came to me like crying about it, blah blah, yeah. and I helped him out, and I was like, you know, blah blah. And then he got into a new relationship and cheated. Yeah, I yeah. would be like, bro, what the? Fuck That's what I'm is saying. Wrong? Yeah. I would literally yeah. then I would question my friendship with him. That, that is so like, true yeah. because it's like you did that same thing that hurt, broke you to another innocent person, yeah. like. Ooh. That would get me fucking hot. That yeah. would get me fucking hot. Yeah. No, that's that's Absolutely. wild as fuck. That's what honestly, are you guys doing if your guys' siblings get cheated on? Oh, gets cheated on. And I'm, like finding, I'm, finding, I'm finding out where he lives. Yeah. 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 I probably wouldn't do anything. <laughs> I don't really get I don't really get involved with uh my brother's relationships. What if they called like if they but if they if they called me and was like, mm. oh my god, I don't know what to do, then I'll be there for them. And I'll probably um blow up their car or whatever. But like other than that, <laughs> nothing else. I've seen so, I've seen my sister good old P. Diddy move, I've seen my sister cry once. Yeah. She got back with the dude. Did I it make ha- you mad? I hated that fucking dude, bro. Yeah. Cause like Is because you know what he did? What he did was really bad? No, I think I don't know. They might have just broken up. I didn't get the full story or like yeah. whatever. But like she came back crying, right? And yeah. I'm like, bro, if you see your, your sister crying, like yeah, that shit yeah, yeah. Hurt, that yeah. shit hurts, right? I hate the world. I, you I, I'm like, I'm like, oh my god, like what the fuck did this guy do, right? And then I think I can't. Remember, I think she took him back or something like that, or she got back with him or something like that. And I fucking hated this dude. Like she'd be like, "Oh, can you say hi to him?" And I'm fucking saying hi to this dude. Like what yeah. the fuck? Aww, um, what a sweet brother. Yeah, but that's nah, dude. I would I would find out where they live. Yeah. Yeah. I have a question. Something I literally just thought of. Do you guys think that the reason people that got cheated on cheat on the next person is because they're even more insecure now? They they want they want to cheat before you do type shit type shit it could or be. like I, so, I can see that but for or they the most think part, you're already like, doing it from like little like, actions and then I know what you mean I I think that could be but at the end of the day like it still okay. still doesn't make it okay or it's still it, not a reason not. to do it mm-hmm. yeah I don't know the psychology behind it yeah. yeah yeah but that could be it that could be a reason that's yeah. something I thought about too but that's even more fucked up I I could see that being a factor but for the most part. I think, I, think you gotta you screw just, I think you yeah, I think you just gotta screw loose. You gotta screw loose. Really, yeah. freely do that. Yeah. No, that's crazy. I seen some of y'all on TikTok talking about how like you cheat first before the other person does. That's crazy to me. It's weird. Come on, Don't do y'all. that. Come on, do better, man. Don't be that guy. What's the what's Don't the be one that name? Gal either. There's a lot of hate in this world. But in this club. Oh, but in this club, <laughs> I like it? it's like the chicks look good, the drinks are flowing. The drinks are flowing, yeah. the music's <laughs> bump, something yeah. like that. Oh dude, I fuck, I gotta find that meme, bro. Great meme, great meme. Or the future verse. It. Yeah, it's an it. evil world we live in. You guys all know that I got cheated on too, right? No, I was about to ask who Wait, what? Do if you guys if you guys haven't watched it, it's on my YouTube channel, Kanye Wester. And I love um that name. What yeah. happened? That's a great name. Yeah, you know, right? You know this. What happened? Um, I got cheated on, and then so I, I made him pay that. me ten thousand dollars. And you got the ten thousand? Yeah. Why Dude. do I remember? I Wait, remember I think you mentioned this story time. Yeah, yeah, I remember this. I remember you did tell. Can you us. do a recap a little bit for the yeah, people? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so basically, uh, I met this guy, and he had a full ass girlfriend in Korea. So I was basically the mistress, keep right? But keep yeah, keep going, keep yeah, going. I was basically the mistress, but. Basically, I found out where she lives and her Instagram and all, all that stuff. And I was going to talk to her. But I was like, you know what? I'm going to have him talk to her. Right? Because I want her to hear from him. Mm-hmm. So then I told him, do it in front of me. He was like, no, I can't. 
And I was like, what the fuck? Then I'm going to do it. He's like, no, please don't. And I was like, what the hell? So we went back and forth. And then he was just not doing it. So I was like, fuck it. Either you do that or you give me $10,000. Period. And then $10,000. I said $10,000 because... I thought I, I was like you to shut up that bro, job. 20, no, I was 20. I asked for ten thousand dollars because I was like, this guy's poor. He's not gonna give me ten thousand dollars. So he, <laughs> the only thing he has to do is call her. Mm-hmm. Like that's his only option, right? And then he was like, Okay, um, I can't do ten. What about five? I was like, motherfucker is haggling right now. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? There's no That's fucking way. Yeah, are you sure on 10? Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, then, yeah, 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 yeah. Like I said, the rest monthly. <laughs> I, <laughs> and I said, and I literally said, are you haggling with me right now? I said, no, 10 or I tell her. And he was like, okay, fine. He said, I can't give you 10 fully, but I can do payment plan. What? He did the payment plan. You put him on a credit karma. Plan? Esther, you're such <laughs> a queen. <laughs> what was the payment plan? What was it a month? It was shit. so it was two thousand dollars the first month, and then it was one thousand dollars every that, other month. Because I knew he didn't have money. He made sixty thousand dollars a month. He dropped. I mean, a, a, a year. He dropped a deposit. Yeah. And then did a payment plan. Wow. That's what you fucking hey, get. Did you keep him on it though? Like you missed his payment. No, no, no. I kept him on it because if he Hell didn't, yeah. if he didn't give me the ten thousand dollars, I take his car as collateral. What do you think this man? Whoa, 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 <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. what? You let it the was car all in a contract. Yeah. You wrote a contract. You, a contract. you yeah. made a contract. Please? Yeah, I called, I called him my lawyer friend. This was like eight a.m. and he was like, "What do you want?" He wrote like, out a contract. Yeah. Do you still have that contract? I do. I do. It, can you, can, you oh send me? No, you, you can watch it on my YouTube channel. Do yeah. you have the contract? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh. How many pages is it? Uh, the contract is just back and forth, dude. It's so funny because I hand hand wrote it on a COVID <laughs> waiver. Oh. <laughs> and then Esther. Yeah, exactly. The first payment he gave to me, he wrote me like a a long two page letter. Oh saying I'm sorry. My God, yeah. you know, let's think about this though. They're like, bro. Cause wait, wait, my fault. How much do you think this man had in his bank account? Um, I know he didn't have much. What do you think he was like? Uh, six figures. <sighs> six figures? No, he makes sixty thousand dollars a year. Do you think this man had like thirty thousand in his bank account? No. You think he had less than thirty thousand? You think that this man had twenty k in his bank account? No, he paid. That's why he. No, no, I don't think so. I'm gonna guess like eleven. You, this man didn't go out because he you, didn't have you money. You have to realize something. There must have been some information that this woman had, or like, like I knew, I knew the information. No, but that's crazy. Like that's crazy to give ten thousand dollars and not just say like, you know what? Yeah, I that's fucked wild, up. Wow, dude, that's wild. Yeah, dude, just his, admit your mistakes that you fucked up. You think he's his, still with her? I'll his tell you wife guys. must have been scary or something. I don't know. She probably would have like chopped his dick off. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, it's, because, it's because it's because his girlfriend in Korea. Um, and her parents are well connected with his parents. And if she found out, or if her parents found out, he'd be fucked. Mm. So I think it was worth it to him to pay me the $10,000. And the reason... So his parents want to find out. Like their parents, like their, her parents and his parents were like, they knew each other. Mm -hmm. And I think that would have been like fucked for him. Kind of like shame to the family a little bit too. Yeah. Yeah. Honestly. Did you ever like try and reach out to her? Like let her know? Or you like, you know, I got my 10 grand. I'm I'm not going to lie. Um, I thought about it, but I'm, I I don't go back on my word. Mm. He signed the contract. He gave me the money. I'm like. So the 10K yeah, was kind of like, kind of like, like, like hush money, like hush money. Like, all right, this 10K, I didn't want it to don't be. talk about it. Yeah, I didn't want it to be. I Fine. actually want, wanted him to tell her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then that's why I put such a high number. I didn't think he was going to say yes. Wow. But it worked. Yes. <laughs> and then he said yes. And I was like, wait, really? Oh, he didn't say yes at first. He said five. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> and then he said, okay, fine, pay me plan. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. So that's is he so still crazy. with the wife? Do you know? I have no idea. I don't I don't know. I wonder if that video is going to pop up on one of those records. He was my ex, man. Of course I know his name. What if we looked him up I know where he lives. Would... I don't know if you'd want to clip this, but if this somehow gets clipped and then it goes viral, I hope she sees it. I hope you see it, girl. Oh. If you're still with him, break up with him. Dang. Man, this man like, was no. full of bullshit, yo. Because <laughs> technically Take you didn't tell down. her. So, <laughs> no. Esther's good. Trust me, I wanted to tell her so bad. Down. Yeah. But for some reason, I, I kind of thought if I did tell her, she wouldn't believe me. Mm-hmm. Or she, or or she would go back to him mm. because of their family ties. Okay. So that's why I was like, why do I need to suffer, man? Right, right. Period. Yeah. So there was like reasons why that's I was fine. like, all right, I'll take the money. Yeah. yeah. No, you you honestly, Damn, I would have done the same up. thing. 10k or telling the woman, I, I'm sorry, I, I'm a girl's girl, but not that much of a girl's girl. <laughs> I'm gonna take the 10k. <laughs> no, I'm a girl's girl, but I don't. 
I mean, I don't know what she's going to do. Honestly, I know a lot of people that go back to their ex mm-hmm. that cheated. And I'm just like, man. Right. There's another reason why I wanted the $10,000, though. So. He has put me through. So, like, she came. So, like, she's in Korea, right? But mm-hmm. she visited one yeah. time. And that's when he wasn't responding to me for, like, seven plus hours. Mm-hmm. And when he came back wow. and he was, like, and she went back home, we did the deed and I got a UTI. <gasps> His oh dirty, my- dirty pee pee, and that's when I was like, "What the fuck?" Like, are you like he knows that I'm very, very cautious about that right. thing. Like, yeah, I it's make sh- no, no, it's UTI. No, UTI. UTI. Yeah. UTI is just like urinary tract infection under the influence. It's not an STI. <laughs> yeah, UTI okay. and STI are two different things. But like, yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, but it could throw <laughs> off your pH balance though. or whatever. See, people tell. Oh my god, dirty You're- dick. Like, oh. yes, not clean. Esther, that's the thing. Like, your body knows. Like, you gotta... Girls, pay attention to what your body tells you because, bro, like, the times where, like, I, I never used to get yeast infections, UTIs, ever, until my cheating-ass motherfucking ex. Ooh, he was yep. the first one that, like, did it with multiple women, you know what I mean? And so, like, that's when I started getting UTIs and your yeast pH infections. Your balance right. is all over and, the place. Right, and when I would search it up, it was like, oh, it's not a sexually transmitted thing. Like, it's usually... it's Usually, it's not for those reasons. But my body was telling me because his dick was fucking dirty. Hold Fuck on. you. Yes. Does that does that mean that he didn't shower from her to you? I don't. Uh, no, no, no. That's not. That's not it. it. Can but carry you know, on after a shower. Like it could throw off your pH balance if he's fucking like multiple women. Well, because isn't, isn't like the the inside, not the not the outside of the dick. No way. Yeah, it's a thing. I don't know about that. I don't mm. think that's correct. Also, you know. Because what if I pee? It'll. Go men can also <laughs> get <laughs> UTIs as well. Like you know, it's it's can, it's yeah. rare. Yeah, it's yeah. rare. It usually happens but... if you don't go pee after sex. Yeah, that's what happens. I heard that was kind of like a like a. You don't have to, but you're more um susceptible. susceptible I know, but like Sage, I don't get... think that's the only reason though. Like there I've could never be... heard UTI from that. That's just no. Yeah, you can, bro. If you have a, but that's what I'm saying. Like if he had sex with her and then went to have sex with you, it would usually that would be make like sense. Uh, STI though. No, no, no like it doesn't a, have to be an STI. Uh, no, no, it doesn't have to be. Really? You can get a UTI from sex. You can get you, uh, you can get a UTI just from having sex with your boyfriend. Yeah. Just like that. Yes. yes yeah, yeah. Yes, you yes, can yes. get it, but you can also get a UTI from a dude that's not clean. Oh, yeah, so he's yeah. not carrying a disease with him. Yeah. It's just dirty, and it just it's like it, yeah. you get dirty down there. It's supposed Damn. to be sterile. But that's crazy that that happens. That's like, crazy. If he Damn, doesn't, sh- if he story. showers even. But then again, though, I also don't know. He came to see me that day, so maybe he had sex with her and then came to see me. I don't who knows. Yeah. I think my stomach hurt. Yeah. Like yeah. why why lie? Why lie and do that to the other person if you know, you know what I mean? It's a, there's a big possibility of you guys both contracting something because of this. Yeah. Like that's fucked up, you know? Bro, people are fucking crazy. I feel bad for the girl though. I'm so sorry. I don't. I feel like a, a lot of <laughs> Nobody. Don't even be sorry. A lot of people in your situation <coughs> would do the same thing, Esther. <laughs> Someone in the YouTube, uh, my YouTube comments was like, no wonder she'd be buying snacks. <laughs> the $10,000 that I got. Oh! <laughs> so many damn snacks. No wonder she has so many snacks. How I was like, fast did you blow that money? Yeah. Uh, it's still there. <laughs> no, I went, I went to He's Vegas and bang. gambled it all. That ass. Oh. Yeah. You, did, That's the best yeah. Way. you doubled it. No, I mean, yeah. I, I won and lost. So she she, she, she came outcome? out negative three k, three k, negative three k. I had a fun time in Vegas. That's all that, that matters. I don't really that, care. For like, free, Vegas, basically. Yeah. Ten yeah. k in Vegas. That's my dream. No, it wasn't the full ten k. Oh. He would be giving it to me in payment. So it is he is he done with the? Oh, he's plan? done. Yeah, he's been done. He finished out. He's done. That's nice. Yeah. That's good. That's good. I would have put interest on that bitch. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Each every year, like. If you live in the plan, it's, yeah, a, it's yeah. an extra like 2%. Nah, fuck that. Just until we die. <laughs> until we die? Because <laughs> I, I got some dirt You're on your name. Villain. I need something. You know what, though? You know what, though? But there's a contract sign. You should have loopholed the contract, though, and had something it, all written in. Like the little bit. letters at the bottom. Yeah. What? Like, Tiny. you should have said something that he wouldn't have read that said something like, for life. You know what I mean? For life? <laughs> But like, Whisper. but like, like a mini transcript. Not like worded very, where we would fuck his head up. You know what I mean? Every five years. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh. oh. For every five years. No, who even knows? I even said on the video, I was like, who even knows if this contract even works? But he did pay it. Also, like, he did feel very, very bad. Um, and also, my, I knew where he lives. I know where he lives. I, my friends know him. So like, if he didn't pay me, like, he would have been fucked. Dude, you should have faked um having a kid. 
So you could have a child sport. <gasps> That's too much, Nas. No, I'm, I'm not. just saying, man. Jesus, <laughs> you guys just aren't seeing the full picture. Y'all ain't thinking all the way of how much money you get out of this. Man. I was no. I'm just we're just trying to teach him a lesson, oh, man, so he okay. doesn't cheat anymore. I'm not trying to. He wouldn't be actually, cheating. I wonder if he learned his lesson, huh? or if he owed another girl 10k. <laughs> He said, okay, the last one did this. I don't know, I don't know if you want to she do She said this. I was allowed to do the payment plan. Can we do that here? Are you okay with that? Imagine. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's really weird, but this has happened to me yeah. before. I can put 2000 down, and then the rest is all monthly. I got you. Yeah. I've done this before. Trust so me. You can trust I'll do it. You can ask you her. Yeah. You can ask her you can trust me. I've done it. It's paid he off. Gets a, he gets a referral from me. Yeah, he does pay it off. <laughs> Yeah, hey girl. So, <laughs> so this happened crazy. again, yeah. and she, went, I'm like, wild. yeah, yeah, girl, he does really pay you back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ma, do you want to ask one more? Okay, That's we'll funny. do one more. Oh fuck, <laughs> That's crazy though, Esther. You know. That's the wildest story. How long ago? Hmm? How long ago? Uh, maybe. I don't uh, this was two a year and a two years ago. About about so I think like, maybe a little less than around two the time years. we met you. No, no, no. No, that was I met you like a year ago. No, a year ago. ago. A no, year ago. We met last year. Yep, we met last year. Really? really? Yeah. No, two no. years ago. We met. In I don't 20, know, man. Two years, well, two years ago. Twenty-one. No, two years ago. we met in twenty twenty-two because we were going to the club with them, and I was we were twenty-one. Yeah. Twenty-three. I think I would say yeah. I guess I guess it was a little after. This year was, and a half. This happened before a little I would before say a year I and met half. you guys. Got you. Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. 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 Okay, last question of the night. How to stop comparing other people's accomplishments to your own? Uh, you guys, comparison is a thief of joy. Don't yes. look at other pe- what other people are doing. Focus on your life. Someone on TikTok said this, okay? She was, like, comparing our lives to, like, Mario Kart. And you know how, like, when you're playing Mario Kart, there's, like, two screens? Mm-hmm. And, like, let's just say you're racing and you're first place, right? But you're like, okay, I'm first place. Let me see what this person is doing. And you look at the person's screen up you immediately end up becoming second place. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like the minute you look at someone else's screen, you lose track and you fall back. So focus on your lane. Wow. Period. And your own. That's a great saying. She's talking about screen peeking? Screen peeking. She's talking about screen peeking? Hey, Call of Duty. Hey, Call of Duty, that shit work though. If we play Call of Duty, that shit work. How do you keep stabbing me from the back? <laughs> <laughs> You're in the obvious peeking. places, bro. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. But I can hear you. <laughs> what about you guys? Honestly, I don't know. I had a really big problem with uh, comparing myself when we were first starting out. But, like, I feel like you grow out of it. I think that it takes a while for you to understand that (laughs) other people's accomplishments are their own. And you have to accomplish things on your own. But uh, that's hard, dude. Like, I'm not going to say that any one specific thing brought me out of it. It just took time just to not think about that I don't remember a time where I was like, this helped me because of this. Nah. It literally just happened over time where I'm like, you know what? I'm going at my own pace. Yes. And things happen the way they happen, and you can't change that. Sometimes. Yeah, because I always knew I was like I shouldn't be comparing, but like I just couldn't stop doing it. Yeah, I couldn't yeah. stop. Doing when it. I was doing it, I feel like, I mean, now looking back at it, I feel like I was, what you said, I was, I wasn't living life at my own pace. Yeah, I was trying to accomplish like what other people had. What mm-hmm. like I don't know if I really wanted it. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. It's just like, it looked good. Like I, I wanted to be as good as somebody else when mm-hmm. I should just be myself. Yeah, you know what I was. I was say, like though? living somebody else's life in a sense. You interrupted me this time. You just interrupted me, man. I was still talking. Who said I was done? Go ahead. Keep going. You done? I'm done. Okay. (laughs) Um, No, I was going to say, actually, the the couple things that did take me out of that mindset, though, was, like, spending time and putting time into other things. So, like, I guess this only works one way. If you're comparing yourself to, like, one specific thing, I think spending time and putting effort into other things as well and not just going, like, full throttle on one thing helps a lot you know spending time with your friends family kind of take your mind off of it and then you realize like that shit's not really that important you know what i mean like you're everyone goes at their own pace for a lot of different things um and i'd say that's the biggest thing that helped me Mm -hmm. yeah Mm -hmm. and i think something sometimes just they're just not realistic sometimes yeah you know what i mean like you can't compare a kid our age like right now he like makes like 500 million a year how the fuck are we gonna do that in a year? Yeah, no way. That's yeah. the type of shit. Crazy that's that. the type of shit I was on, bro. Yeah, and bro, it doesn't make like, it doesn't really make sense. But to you, in that moment, it makes sense. You're like, well, they're the same age as me. Why can't I do yeah. it? Yeah. Sometimes they got the more connections than you. Yeah. By just afar. It also gave me a lot of doubt with myself that I wasn't like as good as somebody else my age that's fucking balling or something. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It, like it made me really question like how good I was, how good I was gonna be at life. Yeah. And like if I'm making the right career choices, if 
if I'm like doing the right thing, I'm, if I'm on the right path. And I think that really fucked up my head like for yeah. a long time. But once I realized that it's okay to not be as good as a lot of people, mm-hmm. like as long as I'm like happy with myself, not even, even if I'm not accomplishing anything, I'm just, I'm happy. I'm content. I know that I'm taking my time with things. Mm-hmm. I think that made me a lot happier. Yeah, if you focus yeah. on yourself, like everything falls in place. Oh yeah, for really? real, hundred thousand percent. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Tetris, it's just Tetris. Just keep working on yourself. Like you know, yes. like you have so much time comparing yourself to others. Why aren't you working on yourself, man? <laughs> Take that time to bar. focus on you. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think like whether it becomes with like either it's physical or it's um something you're working like working towards or working at. I totally just lost my train of thought. You're good. You're good. Uh, I, I, can, I, can, there, I can piggyback off. Go, of what go you're crazy. Saying. Go crazy. Okay, so one thing that helped me a lot was it. was Thank it you. wasn't money wise, but it would help me feel good. Like I would go and play basketball, and I'd be better exactly. than other people. Yeah. And I'd be like, you know what? Like I'm actually, you know what I mean? Like I, I have something that's that's good. It, it, it feels the serotonin. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, serotonin. Yeah. Yeah. It just builds it all mm-hmm. in my head. I'm like, I'm, I'm ending the night off. I'm having a great night. Are chilling, bro? Great shooting night. I'm gonna go get some wings up. Fuck it. Go get some wings up. And that's an even better night. Yeah. And I don't have to worry about shit. Then I'm like, okay, you know what? I got to go to my job the next morning. Yeah. Making money that day. Yeah. I'm not doing nothing. You know? Yeah. Things like that. Yeah. I also think, I think it age depends on uh, like a lot. And yeah. what I, what I was going to say is like, respect the hard work you're putting in, not the the whole like outcome of it. Yes. You know what I mean? Like yeah. the whole, like the whole, the whole, it's real. Like, uh, what do you call it? Enjoy the journey, not the destination, uh-huh. because that's really what it is. You gotta enjoy what you're doing, and you gotta like working towards something. That's it. You shouldn't be looking at what comes out of it. Wow. It's what you're doing. I think that's exactly how I like. I, I mean, just until right now, I kind of realized it, but mm-hmm. I was blindly doing that. Oh I yeah. I was focusing on like, how will I get here? Oh yeah. Instead of literally what I have been. And doing it's like too. it's like the biggest fucking jump ever. It's yeah. like from going <laughs> to like making two hundred dollars like a week to fucking three billion dollars, yeah. and I'm just like. I need to get there. That's yeah. why I was like, I'm not, I'm not good enough. And then, yeah, yeah. what you just said, the journey, I was like, you got to get there. So my yeah. money can't take it. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck no, bro. Fuck no. Yeah, one step at a time. And I think that um, making small goals for yourself <laughs> is really, really good. Because it's true. If you do want to hit that $3 billion, you got to make $500 first. Yeah. And you got to make like a thousand. And then you got to make a mil. And it's like, how are you going to get to all those steps? So <laughs> that's the way I see it. Yeah. You guys honestly said it all. Yeah. yeah. Esther? Thank you. Yeah. You got a lot of knowledge, don't you? Been around for a long time. <laughs> it's, it's, true. Specific, specific. it's true. It's true. I said the most things. What are you talking about? <laughs> what do you mean you said the most things? I she, literally in the said a quote in the oh, beginning. A is, comparison she, she is a thief it. of joy. Uh, got you. Roll that back. Yeah. Got you. That's, that's she did kick it up. Heard that like a thousand times, but <laughs> is that what they used to say in the seventies? she ate with that one. <laughs> Popular saying. You guys are actually you know, in the fifties, but okay. Yeah. Yeah. You guys don't know your history. I don't know. That's guy. <laughs> but I'm gonna lie, I'm still fucking baffled by your whole cheating story, dude. That's yeah, just that's still on the back of my head. That's gotta be top three. That's an S tier story. Top three yeah. stories I've ever heard. What's an S tier story? Like, like you know, it's like A, B, C, D. No, it is. No. Yeah. Yeah. S is yeah, above A. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. S is like above S the A. You know that. You don't know that. S is above A. It's like a golden, incredible basically. story. Like incredible. S A B C D E F G. No, there's no G or E. A B C D E. F. 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 Do you know this? S tier. S tier. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know what S tier is, man. S tier. One Punch Man. You ever watch one? You never watched any anime, bro? Type in your I... culture. <laughs> She's <laughs> not Japanese. Oh. What do Koreans have? Huh? Korean dramas. Yeah, we have oh. Korean dramas. I watch Korean dramas. Oh, okay, so I tapped into, into my. Culture. Our my, movies my, are my fire. Culture. Oh yeah, and our yeah our dramas too. We're up. We're yeah, I've watched. Um, we're on the comeback. I watched Parasite. We're up right now. Huh? Great, great Parasite. Movie. Great movie. Oh, I thought Parasite was okay. Oh, I, was, I think Parasite it's extremely so overrated. It is. What? It is quite. Over, I'm I think not it's not lie. extremely, but overrated. I thought it was a really good movie. You know what? I thought it was really good too. The cinematography or whatever. Hello, what was it called? You know what? I'm gonna just shut up. Wait, but say that again. Try that again. Try that again. Try that again. Cin- cinematography. There you go. Also, Squid Game was fire too. Squid Game was the best show I've ever seen in my life. You know, fire. isn't I season so two times. coming out this month? Yeah, this no, month? No, 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 it's, no, not, no, this no month. it's not. Oh next my, year. you got me hyped for no reason. Oh, next year. I think, okay, I think because okay. of the writer strike. They oh, okay. Back. Oh, dang. Yeah. yeah. They made a reality show off of it though. Squid a reality games? game show. Oh, the zombie one? But that's not really... No. Oh. It's like the actual games. But oh, oh, it's oh, a game the show. Korean... Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's, uh, that was... I watched a clip of it. Yeah. It, was really it just came out... A trailer just came out today, I think. Oh, wait. Yeah. They did that in like some Korean reality TV show uh, before. I think it's an American Oh, there's an American one? Oh, of that's gonna be oh, fun. Oh, I think I know what you guys are talking yeah. about. Yeah. I have no idea what you guys are talking about. It's on Netflix. You'll look tonight. Um... 
Did you guys take a look at that <clears throat> that TikTok I sent in the group chat about that girl talking about uh, how she had a best friend that I didn't I watch it. I can't watch it. Oh, no, you motherfuckers! I watched it for ten seconds. I was like, can I don't I, want this drama. Me, in my like, life. Give me one <laughs> I, I clicked on your thing and then I started scrolling. <laughs> yeah, yeah, give me one second. Let me all sit down. Me, I, I tried doing the little scroll at the bottom and I was like, this is really long. I'll break it down really simply. Do you got to be anywhere? No. Okay, that's great. You got no plans. This is what happens when you get old. Have you heard this drama? Anyways, um, listen to this. Listen to this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can tell she's getting mad about all the old jokes. Um, this is what happened, right? (laughs) So this girl, she had a best friend, right? And uh, so I'm gonna talk in the perspective of the girl who had the boyfriend. Okay. Okay. So what happened was she had a friend. Um, you know what? No. 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 Ah, fuck. I'm just gonna play it. You guys are just gonna fucking listen. Devin, I need you to literally close your fucking eyes and listen. Can I go pee before? Go pee, I do go this? pee, go pee, go pee. This is gonna be a long one. Uh, it's gonna be a long it'll be, it'll and you know, be. grandma needs to pee before she <laughs> listen. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna play her perspective, <laughs> and then. Ah, uh, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> Look, let me see. Let me find it. She left her phone. This one's faster. She left her phone. Let's go through it. Look, at Jeremy texted her. Hey guys, we're gonna find out if they're together. Let's see if Jeremy texted her. We already know they are. <gasps> they say attachment. Jeremy images. Nectar the Seltzer. Is that oh, fu- Jeremy Nectar the <laughs> Seltzer. <laughs> Fuck it. That's his fucking contact name. Is Jeremy Nectar the Seltzer? Nectar the Seltzer is crazy. That's crazy. Okay, so if you guys don't know, there were these two girls that went viral on TikTok. They literally posted this shit like a week or two ago. Um, and one was talking. It was like a get ready with me, and she was talking about this Bessie that did her wrong. This is the girl. That- this is the girl who was in a boy who had a boyfriend. She's the one with the boyfriend. She's the one with the boyfriend, and she's claiming that her bestie did her wrong. And then her bestie came out with a statement, and I'm not gonna lie, I felt like I was getting gaslit the entire time. This literally has 206,000 likes, and it got fucking, let me see. Damn. Hold up, hold up. It got 1.8 mil. The other one got, okay, so this is, this is, this is, uh, the, uh, the one with the boyfriend. Things that this girl that claimed to be a girl's girl has done to me. It's not that bad. He sounds Korean. Never ever in my life have to cut out a person cold turkey. I've never had to go through a friendship breakup because genuinely I feel like I only open up to the people that have been time and I end up loving them for a lifetime. Hopefully, but this girl was just an exception. I am going to try my best to talk through all of this without freaking raging. No, 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 no. The first one is not about I guess. I did not know you could do that. that okay. She's done, but the day that she met. My boyfriend, or like a couple days into it, she added in to her close friend's story and just started posting the random TMIs on her stories, like a attention trap, not even a thirst trap, it's like attention trap. And this was before my boyfriend and I started dating, but like everyone knew that we were into each other. This one kind of goes with the first one. She borrowed my boyfriend's hoodie when we were all over at his house because she was cold. And then she took the hoodie home, which is fine girl like be warm stay warm don't get cold but she continues to wear that hoodie for the next two weeks and posts all about it on social media a picture of her in his hoodie which is again i can let it pass whatever starts to randomly show her love for the brand that my boyfriend likes never heard this girl brag about how much she likes this brand before never until she met my boyfriend. Spending hours getting ready to see him, calling up my other friend and telling her that she thinks he's cute and that she could see herself getting along with him while we were already dating. Mm. Getting him the sandwich that he mentioned he likes and then volunteering to wake up early so that she can hand the sandwich to him so that he can take it to work. I'm kind of surprised right now because now that I'm- that's kind of it. That's now hold up. Now hold up. Now, That's but you guys gotta weird. listen. You guys gotta listen to the other shorty's perspective, though. You love no T. I love T, bro. You're this is every like a person rabbit hole. Sandwich every morning. single one on TikTok, he knows about. Every I sent. I sent you guys the link, right? Um, yeah, it's in the group chat. Is it this one? It's so interesting that actually it just happened to one of my close friends. No way. Yeah. Like similar. Uh, a hoodie? little similar. Yeah. Like she would make like. Lunch boxes for uh, that guy. That yeah, a guy. Uh, my <laughs> friend's man. It's just like, why would you do that? Yeah, okay, for another girl's man. What? So listen, so listen, listen, listen. What so the, the other one, the other one got 1.8 million views. This one of her bestie got, way more now. got 4.6 million views and got 339 thousand likes. So listen to her perspective, because she had me a couple times, but I don't know. 
Let me just clear up some I'm, I'm gonna skip misconceptions that people are having online about me. So I don't know if you saw the video yet, but there's a video about a girl talking about why she ghosted a friend and the reasons behind that. And I am that friend that's been ghosted. And it's just so baffling to me that I had to find out this way when I have reached out so many times. That's really asking you what was wrong. The points that were made in this video, three points that I remember. Close friends, let's start with that. She's saying that I was trying to get at her boyfriend, whatever, because I added her, him on my close friends. First of all, close friends don't mean a lot to me. And it was not only him that I added, it was everyone that I met that night. Like we met at a club together on my birthday and she whispered to me thinking that there was a guy over there that she thought was cute. As her best friend, I'm gonna play Cupid. I went to him and I was like, hey, my friend thinks you're cute. You guys should chat it up. They chatted it up, ended up going well. So we went back to his apartment with him and his friends and me and my friends. So we all kind of became like just comfortable with each other. And obviously if I'm comfortable with you, I'm just gonna add you to my close friends. It's really not a big deal. The attention traps, I don't know what she was referring to because if it was attention traps, like why would she also be on the close friends? If I just wanted that to be an attention trap, I would only add, guys, I'm trying to get a, I don't, I don't know, but I post thirst trap on my public story so that everyone can see that. Mm, the hoodie. I'm just notorious for not giving back hoodies, and I am sorry. I just took longer to give this one back because it was really cute. It's not because it's, it was his hoodie and, like, I wanted to keep it longer and, like, I just wanted to feel cozy up in his hoodie. It was literally because it was cute. The sandwich is, like, the most iconic part of this story. Um, you and I both know, babes, that that sandwich was an expression of my gratitude for mounting my TV. Oh, and at this time, like, we were living together, too, me and this girl. We were living together. We were roommates. Um, so they were together. We were, us three were together in my room mounting the TV and, like, making jokes and making fun. And then, like, I, I really wanted my TV mounted, and he did it. So I was like, oh, my God, like, I'm so thankful. Let me show my gratitude in some way other than just being like, thank you. So I picked up a sandwich um, after work at a bakery that's right next to my work, and I put it in the fridge, and I was like, okay, perfect. We have a sandwich secured for you. Come pick it up before work tomorrow so you can eat it before it spoils. Because why the fuck would I get you a sandwich and have it spoil, you know? She came with him to pick it up. I handed her the sandwich. If I really cared about, like, me getting him the sandwich because it was, like, for him, I would have wanted to hand it to him. But I didn't care. It was just a form of expression. I would have done this for anyone else. It doesn't matter that it was him left the friendship with the other girl together and villainized me and now one year later you come on tiktok to talk about it is so low and why am i blocked i literally saw the video i commented and i said let's not i got it i got it okay so she's this, she said that they all met at a club yes, that night. And for this girl's birthday, and then, the but friend. then the girl makes the video a year later, later talking about my boyfriend that I'm with right now. Yes. So she is making it seem like they were already together for a yeah, long yeah, yeah, period yeah, yeah, of time yeah. when she did this, when they were not. But they no. were still together when she did the whole hoodie thing, right? They were together with the hoodie thing and the sandwich thing. They were together. Yes. 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 But they were living together, though. They were living together, yes. So I don't know. Okay, so look, this is, these are some of the, <laughs> these no, are some of the comments. Saying. These are comments on friends, friends, friends TikTok. Uh, the, the other girl's name is Kelly. I'm on Kelly's side. You did sneaky things and try to disguise them as friendly. Good for her for cutting you off. You kept your friend's boyfriend's hoodie because it was really cute. Yeah, that's weird. That IDK man, weird. I got that mad. I got mad just listening to your reasoning. I think the stuff is pretty minuscule, but moving forward, please protect, practice self awareness and boundaries with your mm. friends' partners. Uh, you obviously uh, have a lack of boundaries and she should have brought it up instead of ghosting you. So like, I'm gonna be honest. I think all of those could be harmless on her side, but say, I think they said it right. She lacks self-awareness. Self like yes. yeah. I'm not gonna if lie. If she's telling the truth. For me, I feel like she was lying. Yes. The whole like, oh, I kept it because it was cute. That's that, that weird. Was, that was, that, that is weird so point. weird. That was the only weird thing that I was like, eh, that, who does that? Go get, go get the fucking sweater. You know? go <laughs> Knowing buy a new that's one, your friend's you know? boyfriend yeah, is crazy. Yeah, yeah, dude. But the sandwich because he put up the TV in a room and they lived together and then the girl was in the room while he was doing that and she didn't give him the sandwich. She gave it to her so he could give it to her. So that she could give it to her boyfriend. That seemed pretty harmless. That, that seemed wait, harmless. Wait. wait, wait, wait. No, but why didn't she buy that girl a sandwich too? I don't know why. She said it was because She's that he had talked about how much he loved this type of sandwich. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, wait, wait you know, did the girl... 
when she was telling the story, I don't know, Esther, if you heard, did she say only the boyfriend mounted it for yeah, her? Or? Yeah, yeah, they were all in the same room and they were mounting it together, but I think the boyfriend the boy, had mounted she said it. The boyfriend mostly. Yeah, yeah. The, did it, but they were all in the room together. Oh, okay. Yeah, but yeah. the thing is, I wouldn't just buy the sandwich for him. I would buy the sandwich for her as well and be like, oh, like for both of you guys, you know, thank you like for letting your boyfriend right. do that. I don't know why, sure. but it's just like, why the whole, why the hell you only get one sandwich for him? Yeah, I'm, yeah I'm she, that's a great way. point. That's or like, weird. Cause, or like, why wouldn't you even just like ask? Yeah. Like, can, you, can oh, you I'm imagine if I, too, if yeah, I got you know something I mean? for like your girlfriend? Yeah. I, like, I'd be like, do you want something too? Cause, Cause she would get him a sandwich. That's what I'm saying. My girlfriend would get Devin a sandwich, but she would also ask me, Yeah. do you want a sandwich? And I used to a boyfriend. Do you want one too? Yeah. It's kind of like, it's kind of like, oh, surprise. Yeah. I got you. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's weird. Like that's so, like imagine her like, oh yeah. Good connection. Good, good connection. connection. Imagine her getting like the sandwich, right? And like, oh, here, this is for your boyfriend, though. Like, yeah, nah, yeah. that's weird. Yeah. That's weird. That's weird. I get that's it. what I I'm get saying. It. Like, be like, oh, you know what? Can you thank your boyfriend for mounting my TV? You know, like, I. I know that he likes the sandwich. I want you guys to eat it together. Like, you know, like, yeah. thank you so much for allow letting him, you know. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. a little weird. It's just like something like that. But like, what? One sandwich? Mm -hmm. Right. Just me being the person I am too. Like, I would think about like, oh, what if the my friend thinks this way just in case? Like, I'm going to get yeah. another sandwich, yeah. you know? Good question. I will agree with the comment saying she lacks self-awareness. In that video, yeah. did they say that she like, told the best friend that she was going to get the boyfriend a sandwich? No. Or she just did it? She just got it, but she gave it to the, her friend. She was like, oh, this is for your man. Oh. Just like it's, that, it's still weird to me. That's still weird. That's I still think, weird. yeah, I think you think as she likes the man. I think because of the hoodie part, maybe the hoodie part was very weird. If she's posting it for two weeks doing that, that's post. Weird. You know what's weird, bro? Okay, look. I'd be like, okay, have my hoodie. We're all at my crib. It's cold. Whatever, take my hoodie. She fucks with the hoodie like a sick ass hoodie. I'd still be like, you know what? Like, get it back when you can. I'm not tripping. But posting it makes. The girlfriend look goofy. Like, yeah. he makes that goofy as fuck, bro. Yeah, and like, especially because they just started. They literally just met that night. She yeah. got the sweater that night and held it on for two weeks as they're both talking. Yeah. Honestly, see, in the first two weeks of you talking to somebody, you feel very strongly about them. You're like, I don't want them to be, like, really associated with anybody because, like, that's the time you're getting to know them. Yeah. And it just seems really weird right. to be posting it on your... This girl's seeing it, you know yeah. what I mean? She's seeing it every day, like... Of her having the hey, boyfriend's friend. Yeah. Hoodie, like, yeah. nah, nah. No self awareness, but right. also that other girl, the first girl, why the hell, like, confront her? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? I don't know TikTok is so bad. Like, <laughs> yeah. she's uh, a year later, too. Lie. A year she's a later. pretty bad person for out of yeah. that on TikTok. She's probably non confrontational, like somebody. Yeah. Oh. oh. So you get it. But, oh. but she took it to the stream on posting it and making it seem very personal, like it just happened. You know, even just, besides yeah. the posting, I think it's weird that she was still wearing it though. Like even if very she weird. didn't post it, very weird. like. Mm -hmm. very weird. Yeah, I mean, she said like, she was still wearing it. Yeah, she was yeah. still wearing it because she said she liked it. Like yeah. I said, um, from a girl's perspective, I get it if you'd be mad. But like I said, I wouldn't. I wouldn't really be like too pissed about it. But like I said, the posting thing just makes you look really weird. Really weird. weird. Yeah. So. Sandwich was weird. Sandwich weird. Hoodie was weird. Mm -hmm. Hoodie was yeah. weird. weirdest. And what about the close friends? I have a very... People are going to think I'm crazy for this. No, no. But no, I... I, I <laughs> okay. But I'm going to say anyways, because this is just Your opinion. how I feel. Um, So I would not like it if a friend was to add my boyfriend on her close stories when that's the type of shit she posts. What type of shit? Mm. I mean, like attention-y type stuff. It's just like, why does he have to know about this? Yeah, you y'all aren't y'all ain't friends. You know, yeah, what yeah, I mean? yeah, you guys yeah. aren't friends. Like, you guys may know each other, but does he really have to know about all of this stuff? You know? Um, can I hear you something? Yeah. Let's say you go out with your with your mans, um, and your mans is a group of group of dudes that he's coming with, and then you guys both meet up, like both groups meet up, um, and everybody gets along. And your homegirl adds all them on Instagram, and then she's going back and she does her thing where she wants to add them all to her close story. Are you like, yo, skip my fucking man? You you can pick everybody else. If it was if it was like attentiony stuff or like selfies a lot, a lot of selfies, something like that. Uh, my friends know not to add my. Okay, so boyfriend. you're still like you're still like nah, bro. Just do not add him. It's just unless I'm like married to this person, no. Okay. Because I also don't. I also have a bad. Um, I don't like connect like, what's it called like. Con Connecting, connecting friends, friends. yeah, um, groups. You know uh, what I mean. So I'm just like the thing is, if I'm not for sure gonna be with this person for life, mm -hmm. y'all don't even be friends. Like you know, like don't yeah. don't like be close close friends. That's true. You know why? Because I've had this instance where four of my close friends dated four of my uh, ex boyfriend's friends, 
and literally it mm. was the biggest jumbled up shit mm. ever Damn. and and then it's just like once i broke up with him they're still dating his friends Ooh. and so it's just like things that like they they could invite me to certain things vice versa and it was yeah. just like a whole mess and i'm just like bro like I don't know. I wouldn't. It's just like you guys can be cordial and you guys can have fun with each other. But man, like, don't be hitting each other up saying like, "Oh, we should go hang out." Oh, we've experienced that on the side. Yeah, like, oh, yeah. I, like we yeah. have. Wait, yeah. what? Really? It sounds. It's uh, just drama. Yeah, I feel like. But um, that's what happens when you mix big groups of people, though. But yeah, um, like, wouldn't you be like, wouldn't you feel a little betrayed if, like, let's just say your guy friend started hanging out with the my ex girlfriend's friends friend group? Yes. No. Uh, or, or hold on. Let me see. Let, let oh, me see yeah, if I see that. Your right. girls' but, friends. So yeah, your your girl, your girl, your ex girl is hanging out with your friends. Yeah, because I'd be they're like, all friends. Yeah, I'd be like, no, you're well, not. Would you, yeah, wouldn't 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 you be upset at your bros? Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'd be like, what the fuck? Unless like, they were just trying to hit, then I'd be like, yo, get your nut off. But <laughs> if they, oh, if they weren't, God. no, no, I'm being sorted ass. But if they were like like hanging out or whatever, I'd be like, yo, man, that's not cool. Yeah, that's yeah. not chilling. Yeah, like. I was like, nah, dude. You guys can be cordial, but like close friends, like you know, have each other's number, like invite, like directly to a barbecue type shit. No. If it was just like go through me. So if it was stories though, where it was like scenic stuff, like old photos of them, like them eating, close friends. Are you then? That's what they're posting on their close friends. Yeah. Why the fuck? Why the fuck does my boyfriend gotta know that you like scenic shit? So you're still like no. You're still like no. I don't care. You guys aren't close friends. Okay. Okay. What do you think? Um, I still, I think I'm going to take, take a peep at it. I'm going to be like, oh, you added him to your close friends. Interesting. Mm. But it's not enough to like bring it up. Mm. Yeah. Just because I know a lot of people that like add a lot of people on close friends. But th- something that's weird. Okay. So no, I, I get it. I, it's not something that I would bring yeah. up too, mm-hmm. but I, I'd keep a note. Mm-hmm. Right. But then the thing is with close friends, I don't have close friends because I'm just like, oh, that's, I, it's so annoying to like. Same. actually oh, same. like oh, click them you know and i'm just like the fact that you added them and then like actually click them to be to view your mm. close story i know it may be nothing i think i'm overthinking stuff but that's where my mind goes and i'm just like i'm gonna take note of it i'm like why oh, for sure yeah for why sure. do you Taking want him to it. know what you're doing like it's yeah y'all ain't friends like that that is true yeah. you are yeah. reading every account you're clicking on but i do think a lot so that may be my issue what Tell about us. you guys um of that i mean i don't use close friends either none Same. of our friend group uses close friends right? no. but i because i've grown up with you guys and like i know your guys' intentions i don't think i'd be even if you guys were posting like selfies i don't think i'd really care yeah mm. but that's like why would i add your girlfriend to my close friends you know you know what's weird bro i don't think i think about it now that they I mention mean, it now i'm like yeah why are you adding her you know yeah, what i mean yeah. but like if someone would tell me that mm-hmm. but like if you had added her or you added her or someone else had added her off rip yeah and like let's say we're next to each other and she's scrolling through stories and it's you like it's or one of y'all like <laughs> on the on the story yeah right I I, I wouldn't I don't well, think I double take oh, <laughs> no I don't think I I don't think I double take it unless yeah. it's like mad fucking it's thirst weird. trappy yeah, like yeah, yeah, yeah. Carrie in the gym posing all sweaty <laughs> then I'd be like oh nah like don't be part of that I just think it's it's just an odd thing to do like yeah. there's no yeah. there's no point leave your friends boyfriends girlfriends out of it if you think, it really you think, isn't crazy um in friend groups uh-huh. uh your friend's girlfriend or boyfriend is just an extension of them or do you think Our they friends girlfriends boyfriend. do you think oh. that do you think that they're just they should just be seen as like do you think that you should view all of our girlfriends just as an extension of your friend you gotta no mean? unless they're mm. assholes obviously then yeah. like that's okay. where it is but if they're cool people then i'm gonna be like yeah that, like that's our home that's yeah. our home girl that's our yeah, home yeah. Girl? yeah. yeah. Homie. That's homie. our homie? Yeah. Homie. What you guys think? Like your your girls, man's boyfriends, do you think they are just an extension of your girlfriend or are they your homie? They're not I wouldn't say they're my homies. Like I wouldn't hit them up like and eat one on one. Yeah. Just because I like oh, their yeah. personality. No, that's fine. That's fine. No, 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 no. Yeah. But I, like I'd be yeah, I could I could call some of them my friends. But, but do you see them though? Like I'm talking about like as a friend or do you see them as so-and-so's boyfriend? That would be my boyfriend's friends. Your girlfriend's friends? No. But boyfriend's friends. My boyfriend's friend. I'm, I, She's a girl. I'm a girl and, and I like guys. likes guys. His friends? <laughs> yeah, 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 His friends? His friends? I'm not talking about that. I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about your homegirls 
their boyfriends. Oh, you know that, that, no, that's, yeah. that's, that's, okay. that's, that's my girl's. About. That's right. my girl's boyfriend. Like I don't. I, I draw that boundary where it's just like I'm gonna be nice and I'm gonna make sure he has fun. If he if I invite him to if if I have invited them as a couple to my party, but I'm not adding him. That's I'm not. About. I don't. Yeah. I'm not gonna ask for his number. Like, you know what I mean? Like, sometimes they get too close like that, and okay. I don't like that. Okay, so even a cool-ass dude, he will always be my friend's boyfriend. Yes. Oh, that also depends on how close you are to that friend. Bestie. Let's yeah. say it's your bestie. Then yes. Then obviously that's going to be a homie. I would that's, a ho that's your homie. Yeah. That's your homie. I agree with Sage. That's your best, that's your best girlfriend. That's, nope. that's her man. Yeah, because that's because man. the thing is, at the end of the day, my loyalty is to her. And if, let's just say they broke up, I'm just like... If he if he was to come to me and be like oh like I really need to talk to let's just say my friend Grace like you know like we got into a fight I need your help I'm gonna be like nah you ain't a friend yeah yeah you are my girl's boyfriend yeah, and yeah. don't talk to me you know because I'm gonna go straight to her I'm gonna tell him that straight up yeah yeah you know that's it he's not yeah I'm the same way I don't even call them by their name I'm like oh your man's or this person's man's yeah 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 yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not gonna lie, even with like my bestest friends, I've been close with like my bestest friends, like girlfriends, like we talk, like uh, we drank together, everything, like um, super chilling. And I always just saw them as like my best friend's girlfriend. I never yeah. was like, that's that's the homegirl, like that's my friend. Yeah, yeah. No, no. Exactly. Anyways, I'm trying to think of a guy situation that happens with like our home, like, my, like let's say Madu brought a boy. We've never been like, tight that would somebody. probably be a little bit different because i feel like that's a dude though you know what i mean yeah, like yeah. i'd probably get along with him a lot more but, but when does that ever happen though and well she brings around really terrible guys okay so <laughs> it's not gonna happen <laughs> but i'm talking about any, any no i'm not gonna lie. i feel like you guys would have liked them if they didn't have the cheating aspect to them probably would have fucked with him if he wasn't like dating you but i still think i'd be like you're still a terrible human being though a lot of the dudes they ain't all up there i'm gonna be honest with you man <laughs> yeah. there's not a lot going on up there well, Mara, you have told us that you like you don't like super smart guys. Should I dumb? Which I no, I also don't. Smart guys are are. You said it. You okay. said it. You said it. You said it. I'm not gonna lie. That, that used to be me. Oh, not one time I met somebody and he was really smart and I was like, oh my god, this is actually really attractive and I'm in love with you. Nick, one day you're gonna get hit. He's gonna get hit by a car. Oh my god, the note. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> you're gonna die by a car it's gonna say car crash no. I don't know Mato's no. Tesla might run over you one day honestly I, I would day. not be surprised if Mato hit me with a car <laughs> you, you, then you deserve it cause no, yeah, I know yeah. Mato can't do no wrong no if Mato if can. Mato hit me with her car I'd be like this was Basically. deserved <laughs> yeah I, I would literally be like bro I'd dab her up to I'd be fair, like I'd probably be like you can't you can't yeah, yeah yeah I think I literally think everyone would be there like yeah, yeah you got it you got it coming for you yeah Mato he gave you your pass I'd be okay one day <laughs> I'd be milking, I'd be milking that, that injury though. Oh yeah, 10k a month. 10k oh, a month on no, 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 no. Um anyways though, that basically answered all the questions y'all get. It does, it anyways, does. Go ahead and, sign us off. and that has been another episode of Summer Talks. I'm your host, Maru. I'm Nick. I'm Sage. Oh. I don't know if I should, should say my Esther. name or Cynthia. Esther. <laughs> <laughs> Well, do you think they noticed that I was not Cynthia? I hope that oh, they do. This whole I episode. hope that they leave a comment if you didn't notice. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys didn't know that that's actually Esther sitting over yeah. there. Ah, you guys, you got I you. tricked you. you got I you tricked got you. You got gotcha. you. I am Davino. And make sure to lock in, subscribe. Lock in. Lock in. Lock in. Lock in. Always lock in. Two <laughs> Summer Talks. She's doubling down on the lock in. Okay. Lock Stand, in. On okay. Stand, on Stand on business. Stand on business. Stand on business. Yep. Period. Yep. That's it. Nope, nope. Nope. There's so much more. Okay. Make sure to like, subscribe, um, comment down below. If you, if if you if, thought, if you Esther, thought was Esther was Cynthia or not, and follow us on our socials if you want to. <laughs> and that's it. It's valid. Yeah, and follow me on yeah. my YouTube channel, yeah. Kanye Wester. Follow me on Instagram, Kanye Wester. Follow me on TikTok, Kanye Wester. And I also have a podcast with three of my closest friends, okay? And it's called Under the Influence. Thank you guys for watching. And thank you guys also for coming to our party. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. She was fire. So I'm good, like, right? You guys have to next time. You guys are yeah, all invited. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Guys, um, I'll leave all of Esther's socials in the description. If you guys want to catch more of us, check us out on our Patreon. Um, we post once a week on there. We play games. We do interviews. Um, and we recently started doing live call-ins. So if y'all got any issues or problems that you need help with or just a good laugh, crazy. I would call the fuck in. Call Anyways, in. I'll catch you guys. Peace. Stay locked That's in. That's crazy, y'all. You guys do that? Is Dude, it we, we did it, we we did it for the first time. So and it was the...